Like, why is it the first thing I was like, oh yeah, I haven't streamed in a while. I guess I better just throw myself straight into the fucking Jump King work. Um. Yeah, welcome, Fab, by the way. I'm trying to remember now. Okay, so we got past the. F no, I think we got close to the top of the fly section. Or something like that. I actually can't remember. It's been a while. Because it's been since last Sunday, I think. But yeah, I started Celeste. Oh, I'd have to look up again what that game looks like. I, I think I know what you're on about. Or at least I've heard it before. <laughs> That's the, at the very least I can, um, say. Is it good? Because, like, I, I don't, like, I've genuinely never played it, so I'm not sure. Oh. One good thing I will mention so far about Jump King is it's cool that I still have a bit of the memory from last week. Like, I'm still trying to make it over to that platform to do thing, but yeah. How's your day going? It's been going well, honestly. I've been just doing a lot of, um... I'll just call it like back end maintenance. Especially because, um. Actually, I need to just show real quick. I don't know if you noticed during the break just there. I now have to call it break because I'm not calling it music break anymore. But the music break, now named break, doesn't actually play music anymore. The just camera scene doesn't have the Sherry Arbor story ad on the side of it. And uh, the scroll text down the bottom doesn't actually shout out my other social medias anymore. I'm basically just preparing for, um tomorrow when like the new twitch ad changes come in because i don't want to be hit by that because um i, I just don't want to be panned off twitch like as simple as that you know um but i do know though like i do have the same scroll text copied and pasted for um well copied at the very least so that if i want to use it for the kicker youtube one i can but i'd have to make new scenes for youtube unless i just use the kick one to go off of that the um, whole burning ad changes and all that, they, it happened, I think, near the start of the month, so people have probably forgotten by now. Um, let me just pull it up real quick, because I should still have thing. Oh, man, I wish I could watch that on stream. I was actually watching uh, Dog VA's, a bit of his charity auction thing, and I'll probably watch the rest of it, because he uploaded the whole VOD. Um, why did I... Wait, my instinct was literally to open YouTube, uh, which... Add changes. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Where's like twi- Like they all- It's all these like news sites, but like none of them ever actually- Do they link back to Twitch itself? Oh wait, hold on. Oh yeah, no, I mean The Verge just to be a good example. Because it's the one I was reading off again, but- I, I know like, for me it probably wouldn't even count because I don't really, um- Whatchamacallit, I don't- like, have paid ads or anything like that on the stream, but it's just in case they interpret it that way and I just get banned for no reason, like, so. Where do we start? It's, like, down here, right? Where it's, like, you can't, like, have, um... No, I think that's okay because that's in purple. It's... Oh, yeah, this fucking one. I forgot about this. If you... You know the way some streamers have, like, a logo at, like, the top portion of their screen right here? Like... I think um, some VTubers probably have that themselves. They'll have, like, their name at the top or something. Or even just, like, an ad at the top. Even my ad that used to be right here. Like, that doesn't count for 3%. And that's only, like, what 3% is. It's mad. There's a few other bits. I'm skimming over a lot of it. Let me actually open Twitter for this one. So, yeah. Twitch's new brand and content guidelines. On-stream logos, 3% size. Burn in video ads are not allowed. Uh, display ads are not allowed, and audio ads, which nobody ever uses, are not allowed. And then, this is the, like, graphics they give as well. But I think people are saying the graphics is, like, like, bro, like, they're not even displaying it properly. Um, so, yeah, you can't, like, in the middle of this, I can't just pull up, like, the latest, like, Sherry Opera story video if I was paid to do that, because that'd be bad. Any, like, esports organization that have, like, banner ads like this, they can't have them anymore. So, like, it's a big hoopla. I'm just basically waiting to see what happens tomorrow. I might even stream on Twitch tomorrow. I might stream on, um, YouTube or something like that. Maybe even Kick. Uh, branded panels. That's okay. 
And then, you know, the product, if it's already in the background, that's okay. Um, so I guess that, yeah, with my, like, just camera scene, I'm not really, you know, pointing to the Sherry Albert story and saying, go, like, follow the channel. It's just there in the background. Uh, sponsored games are allowed. You can endorse a product and you can link to stuff. It's very weird. But at the same time, people have said that YouTube do this as well. But yeah, it is how it is. Uh, yeah, sorry. I, I just had to go on a little rant about that. Because I, I just, I'm just i just worried, you know? I just don't want to get banned. Even though I most likely won't be the target for this. But just in case I'm accidentally the target for it. Because like, mistakes do happen. And I feel like I'll just get uh, caught in the crossfire. Oh, right. Back to work. <laughs> I don't even call this playing a game now, I just call this working. <laughs> but I will, I will, um, eventually make this jump properly. And we'll get to the top, meet the babe. And it'll be game over for jumping whenever I actually get this jump done properly. I really do need to get back into the rhythm of it though, because I think it... Actually, it might have even been Sunday since I last streamed. It's been a while though, because I ha I didn't stream Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. I didn't stream Thursday, and today's Friday, right? So, yeah. First time running Ghost of Aid. I am indeed, uh, Zero. Or should I just call you Cool? I'm sorry, I'm really bad with pronouncing names. So it's up to you. Because even someone else is like, you know what, I know you're not going to get my name. Just so just call me, like, Alex. Like, Zero is fine. Not grand, okay. It is Zero, right? And I'm not pronouncing that wrong. I probably am. So I wouldn't imagine it's X Zero. You said it correctly, Grand, yeah. You know, I've been. What should we go? Oh, why am I pausing? I've been playing. Well, actually, as you can see there, I've been playing the game for seven hours, but this is my first um, attempt at trying to get through Ghost of the Babe. After successfully completing the first map, I think it was last year I completed the first map. Just recently, like probably a few weeks ago, completing map two. Uh, after 30 odd hours. Man, if I can make this jump, I, that'd be so cool. And now we're obviously seven hours into this. I already forgot what hours I uh, called out, but yeah. I've been joined by people like Fab and God and all that, who have been like, give me directions when I've already passed the section. So like when I'm already out of a uh, area, I don't mind getting hints for that because like I've already done the area. But when I'm in a new area, I prefer to stay, like, um, spoiler-free and all that, you know? I prefer to let myself suffer, basically. <laughs> uh, don't even stress, if you've already completed the two others, you already know the first one is always brutal. After that, it's relatively easy. Yeah. Now, that's if I ever decide to go back into the game, but hopefully I don't. Maybe, <laughs> maybe for a future follower goal, if I really miss Jump King, we'll just download some, uh, community-made maps, but... I can't guarantee anything, because I remember saying before, now, nah, once I'm done this, we close in the game, we ain't open this ever again, like, or something on that line, so I, I might have at least thought that. But anyway, sorry, I'm rambling. Oh, shit. I'm also trying to get back into the groove of this, because it's been since, I think, it was sometime last week when I played, so, like, just need to get used to it again. Oh, yeah, I need to be on the third step, fuck. Unfortunately for me, I've got to complete all three quite a few times, chasing the ever so elusive 100%. Actually, what even is 100%? Let me see, I'm not doxing myself, am I? No, okay. Uh, game overview, achievements. Let's see. Actually, maybe I shouldn't read the achievements. Wait, actually, how many are there, actually? 48, Jesus. 100% is pain, absolute pain. Honestly, I'm already in pain with, like, dropping back down to bog. I can't imagine the 100 percenting the game. Because i even seen before, like, with, um, getting over it. To 100% that, I think you need to play the game, like, 50 times or some shit like that. And I'm like, nah, I'm good, I don't want to do that, like... God, I'm already sweating. Um... Got a warning before I joined your stream. I don't know if I ever can. Mm. Sexual content. Honestly, there are some times where I'll just fucking, like, rage and I'll just be spewing, like, sexual stuff. So, like, that's why I put that there. Ice new babe. Uh, it's just too hard. Yeah. Oh, I almost fell. But yeah, I don't do, like, anything on purposely sexual or anything like that. 
It's just, I might as well just cover all my bases whilst I can. Just like I was talking to Fab about the ad guidelines now. Like, I don't actually get sponsorships, but I've covered my bases, like, just in case. Like, this text scrolling at the bottom of the screen, there used to be so much more, but now I've removed a lot of it, just in case. I'm waiting for Kick to get back on me on that offer. <laughs> when I said $20 is $20. Game pretty close, but what's left is the uh, real test. Everything proper or thing prior, that's it, yeah, that's the word I was thinking about. Even I couldn't think about it. I was like, wait, what was that word again? Oh no, you're grand, honestly. Like, I can't speak, so we have something in common, like. We both can't use the English uh, dialogue. Oh god. Oh, actually, that's a good spot to land. Yeah, as you can see as well, we already have the um, cosmetics for the, um, from this, like, map. But I didn't bother getting the, um, other, like, items from the other ones because I was just more focused on completing the game at the time, so. Yeah. I literally just got those today. Oh, the yellow boots, yeah. Oh, shit. Wait. Okay, we're good. Honestly, they I guess they might be kind of handy in, like, darker places where you don't know if your boot's gonna go off the edge or not. Like, the brightness- Actually, I keep calling them yellow as well. The boots in general. It's just- It's just- Yeah, you just have them, you know? Kick has the warning before you click on streams as well. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it, Justin? It'd have the, um... 18 plus warning. But yeah, welcome, by the way, Lobster. Uh, I was gonna call you Lobster, but your actual name. Or your fucking username. Welcome, Justin. How goes, though? Um... Oh, yeah, wait, that's what you meant by the fucking content, or the warning. Anti oh, no, you said sexual, though. That's different. There's, like... Oh, my God. Yeah, actually, there's so many warnings now. I've left the streams on purposely 18+, plus just because I'm not arsed to fucking turn the 18+, plus one off. And then, recently, I added the uh, other two markers, because Twitch offered them. And I want to make... Again, just make sure I cover my basis. I mean, I swear at one point I was raging and I was talking about dicking down people's, like, fucking mothers, like, so, yeah. Uh, that's how I feel about boots from Main Bay. Uh, the design makes it so much easier for proper placement on platform. Yeah. I'd imagine so, like. And can we argue for a minute if these are actually yellow boots or golden boots? Because, like, I keep saying yellow, but they might actually be golden, right? Or is there even Actually, wait, is the, the item description, is that... Oh, no, it's yellow, yeah, it says yellow, yeah, they are yellow, yeah. <laughs> Just reconfirm. Sleek yellow shoes. Quality like this cannot be bought. Yeah, <laughs> yellow confirmed. Okay, I wasn't going mad insane by calling them yellow all the time. I thought they were meant to be, like, gold, like a kind of trophy kind of thing. Obviously, they're not. Okay, we're good. Sorry, I was just panicking. God, I remember those names actually about the fucking Star Wars prequel. It's like, Anakin, stop panicking. I've got a planikin or something like that. Oh my god. Oh, we're good. I'm dreading the giant boots run. I think someone was doing that the last day. I can't remember who. I don't know if it was Fab or God or someone else. But they were mentioning that as well. I, I already know what the boots are. I, I wouldn't want to do the fucking <laughs> big boots. Because doesn't it, like, make you really heavy so you can't even walk or something? So you're essentially just going every, like, you know, jumping around everywhere like it's snow. Because if it is that, that's pain. Come on, we can make it back to the flies. Just give me a minute. I need to readjust myself for this section. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, you actual troll, Joe. You troll. Oh, we're cool. We're cool. We're cool. Just, um, most people say the snake ring is tougher, but I think it's the boots. Yeah. I think the snake ring is meant to be handy for... Um, 
sections is enough. Or do you mean it's like tougher to get? Because the moment I heard I had to go back down the map just to chase the bird to get the fucking ring, I'm like, mm, I'm good. I'll, I'll, I'll keep making progress as much as I can, you know? <laughs> um, snake ring is way tougher. Tougher to use, but I find it incredibly useful. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, like, doesn't it, like, allow you to, like, walk in snow and shit? Like, okay, ignore me just falling to the bomb. Oh, never mind. I'm good. Um, but it allows you to walk in snow and stuff, right? So if I was doing this section, I could just walk around. Okay, why did I do that? I could actually, like, walk around and not be stopped by the... Well, I say snow, but I mean the muck. Or whatever. Bog, there we go. Call it as it is, Joe. We're back in Ireland. I've got... Uh, sorry. Wait. Oh, no, I thought I saw something. Oh, it's him talking, that's why. Out of the corner of my eye, if I see, like, white dialogue or white text on, the, like... The screen on the side, I think it's Hunt, like chatting, but it's just your man here. Like, uh, they have BMW that <laughs> could change colors. Oh, yeah, I think I've actually seen that, Justin. Um, mad car never would get like a car like that because it's too much for me, but hey, you know what? They do them. Actually, isn't it like another car manufacturer that do fucking like they literally charge you for every part of the car or some shit like that? Like to use certain sections of the car. I find ice cancelling easier than adjusting jumps because of bad positioning due to boots. Yeah. Oh. I still got it in me. Um, as well as that actually on the car stuff. I think there's like also like a car manufacturer that have like a kind of like subscription model or some shit. Where like you get the whole car and if you don't pay your installments on the car, it starts doing things. So it slowly locks you out from like using the car properly. And then eventually the last step is literally the car just driving itself back to the dealership, which is like the fucking most sci-fi thing you can ever think about, like. Oh, I jumped too far on that one. I mean, I don't know if it's made yet, but like maybe they'll realize, hey, that's kind of fucked up to have like a car that just literally drives itself back. Especially with like, you know, self-driving not really being a... Um, not completely, I'd say, uh, not developed enough yet. There we go. I mean, there's already, like, um, self-driving cars. Ha oh, shit. Having problems with things. I don't know why I didn't full jump that. So I wouldn't imagine it go down well, like, with a car trying to find its way back to a dealership, like... Oh, fuck no, no. If you tell me a plane would fly itself, I don't know if I'd ever get on it, honestly. I would rather human air than a fucking computer, like. Sure, it could be useful in some sections, but, like, you need that, like, kind of human, um, you know, whatchamacallit, you need that, like, human interaction so that if shit does hit the fan and you physically see it where a computer can't, like, you can actually fix it, you know? The human touch, yeah. Will self-driving Uber ever be invented? Honestly, I wouldn't even like be surprised if they'd be looking into that next. With the history of what they were doing during the time. I remember watching a Magnates uh, video on it, Magnates Media. The one that was going to get, um, whatchamacallit, deleted off of YouTube from Alex Edson and all that. I remember they made a video on Uber and their uprising and they seemed like they were using... Um, I can't remember the exact words. I won't say it just in case I'm wrong, but yeah. It just feels like something they would do, though. Uh, I watched the movie Good Boys. Oh, is that a movie? I thought it was a show, wasn't it? Oh, no, I'm, I might be thinking of something else. How was it? I haven't, like, watched anything in a while. I have been saying to myself, though, I want to, like, sub to Netflix again soon to actually finish Breaking Bad, then watch the movie, and then watch Better Call Saul. And then just have a month where instead of, I'm, like, instead of watching anime, it's just fucking watching, like, uh, Netflix good stuff, you know? The good shit Netflix put out. Or they have, anyway. It wasn't good. Ah, rest in peace. You didn't even find a little bit of enjoyment in it? Oh god. 
Yeah, Zero, get used to this section. You're going to be seeing it quite a bit. It's <laughs> just like every single stream without fail, I will fall down into this section. Not even for a bit, it just happens like. Uh, like two seams. Um, that's about it. Two seams, that's about it. Like two or uh, five stars, or what are you on about when you say twos? Or is that like a character? I may just need more information. I'm not an AI collecting information, I swear. Even though I do have fucking AI tendencies sometimes, like. Okay, there we go, that's good. So don't tell Vito there's a problem with my AI. <laughs> nah, if I start chanting that, like, that'd be funny. Oh, so it's just two scenes, yeah. That, like, you liked about it, and then that's really it. That's a shame. Okay, just give me a minute. I want to actually make it out of here. Nah, I'm going to slip. For the first time. Nah, don't even kid yourself, Joe. It's not the first time you're ever going to be here. Like, I wish it was, though. Okay, we've made it back out of the bog for Ireland. So, like, the dub it. There we go. And we're back into the rhythm. Just give me a minute. They didn't uh, build up the characters or have something that made me feel for the characters. Yeah. That's a problem with a lot of movies, isn't it? Like, especially movie length uh, stuff as well. Like, especially for a film that's like an hour and a bit. Like, it's not enough time to properly tell a story, you know? I say that now, but watch like Spider Man or something somehow be an hour and a bit. I'm like, how? That film was so good. Like, it's a pity though with the Spider Verse about all the um, animation drama that surrounds it how like a lot of people have to just leave because of the working conditions. I hope they delay the next Spider-Man if that's the case, honestly. I think like people shouldn't be treated as like cogs in a machine. Cause then like your product gets like defected. It's just bad at the end of it all for every party, like the quality of the product you're trying to produce and for your workforce, you know? It's like word of mouth. Like there's a place nearby I was gonna work at. But the reason I don't work at it is because, like, it just has such a bad reputation to work at it. But a lot of people work at it because it's, like, one of the best options, like, close by to work at. Oh, shit. Why did I... I'm literally throwing at this point. Um, Like, I feel like good comedy has build up to punchline, yeah. What happened? It's just, like, a lot of animators were feeling, I think, over... Well, not feeling, but were being, um... I think it's like, uh, not burnout, what's the word I'm looking for? Like crunch time and all that, and just basically the usual sort of unfortunate, like corporate stuff where it's like the employees are told to do this, this, and this, and it's not really good for the mental health of everyone, and yeah. Even with that, I'm surprised they still made the film really well, like. But I don't think it's worth it though if, like, people have to suffer a lot just to make it work out. I need to... Oh, yeah, that's what... Okay, I need to hop onto that platform. I was trying to remember there what I did the last day. Nope, that's gonna fail. There we go. Hopefully I just start getting more efficient at doing this. Dun, dun, dun. I definitely... I feel like I did make it to the section above the fly section. I just can't remember what it was. But then again, I think the reason I can't remember is because I didn't reach it, like... Oh, you dumbass. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Is that... I feel like I hear my, like, window whistling. If that gets annoying, I might just close it over. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, dumbass. Well, here we go. Revisiting uh, Bog again, you know how it is. Why'd I do that? Wait, I was in a, such a, like, decent position. You didn't get that far. Damn. 
Also, wait, where did I, did I even get to the end of the fly section or did I just keep like failing in it? Oh, my nose. I thought like I was tearing up because of the fucking way your comments like, oh, hi ghost. The way your like, comment uh, initially was to my brain when it registered it, but it's not, it's my nose. I know that you would, uh, I know that you would know. Oh, yeah, okay, fair. So we're somewhere in the fly section at the very least. That's not needed. This is needed. Oh, my God. It's like this man's really throws. There we go. Dun, dun, dun. What's that about this not being your favorite song, Joe? Or being a bad song, actually? Oh my god, I thought that was going to turn out much more worse. But then again, an annoying song can really be an earworm if you hate it enough. I mean, that's how I, I guess I started, like not really hating too much certain songs especially when you hear it over and over it's hard to hate it depending on like the environment you're hearing it in if you're at work and you're hearing the same songs over and over like christmas songs that just sounds like hell i hope my workplace isn't like that during the uh, christmas time because that would actually drive me mental i think okay i, I think i at least made it above this screen I think. Um, did you hear about Monster Energy Drink is going to buy Bang? Damn. <laughs> They're just like, huh, so uh, competition. I guess we might as well just buy them. I guess why not, honestly. I just hope they're not still pursuing that, um, <clears throat> what was it, that lawsuit against the, uh, the game Dark Deception. Because they were trying to, like, sue them for a copyright infringement of the use of the, t like, literally the word monster or something like that. Because Dark Deception made a game and a DLC pack or something like that. So it was like, Dark Deception, uh, monster creators and monsters or something like that. And it features, like, content creators, like YouTubers and stuff. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's funny how that happens, but I literally just drank a monster the other day. I was so against buying Monster ever again, but then I just went and bought it anyway. Like, it is stupid, honestly. They have no reason to be, like, you know, trying to gouge a fucking, like, innocent little game just wanting to make a cool, like, little DLC with uh, some YouTubers and stuff. Like, they're not even- there's not a single energy drink can- oh, why did I do that? There's not a single energy drink can in the game, as far as I'm aware. Or I don't think so, anyway. Like, they, I don't even think they tried to riff off of Monster at all as well, like, it's just, it's just bad. If I really had the choice, I'd switch to G Fuel. But unfortunately, we still don't get G Fuel in Ireland. And if we do, it's fucking price hike to shit. That's why, I, like, last time I saw it, I literally didn't buy it, because I was like, I'm not spending this amount for a fucking G Fuel can, like... Like, I know it sounds like crazy talk, but the most I'd ever spend on G Fuel is probably three quid, and that's it. And, like, that's a decent price for here in Ireland, like. Even for a prime bottle, three quid is decent as well, like. It's just madness. Um. Uh, wouldn't it just be free promotion? With the monster thing? Not really, because, like. The game and, like, the drink have nothing to do with each other. Like, they're not connected at all, other than by the word monster. Like, that's it. Oh, hi, ghost. And then, fucking, the legal team of fucking monster just went out of their way to just, like, well, try to fuck them over. Hopefully they don't get fucked over. They don't really deserve it, honestly. 
basically it just shouldn't have been done in the first place. They shouldn't have to like, basically at this point, change their name just because like they sound similar to something else. Like, I could buy you and sell it to you. <laughs> but you think you have to think about the um, delivery price there, Justin. Like, how much would it cost to actually ship, like, even just, like, a crate of them, like, you know, a pack of four? Uh, that would just give Monster more energy or more money if they left it. Um, I mean, like, they, they just shouldn't have done it full stop. Like, they shouldn't have tried to stir up drama where there's no need for drama, like... And, like, I say monster, like, because the game involves, like, having monsters. Actually, no, way. was it monsters and cr creators and monsters? It might have been creator and monsters. Yeah, because, no, creators and monster doesn't sound... I think, yeah, it's plural. I, that, that makes even less sense, then, because that's plural. Hold on, wait. No, I need to look this up now. I need to make sure I'm getting my facts right here for a minute. I would watch a video, but I think I'll just look it up once. Monster Law Who Um I can't remember wow. Dark Deception, there it is. Yeah, this is it, right? Hold on, let me Monsters and Morals. So, Dark Deception, Monster Mortal Devs, uh, sued by Monster Energy because of the word monsters. Tell the self explain or explain self monsters pulling a Tim uh, Langdale, and they are now throwing the developers of a game called Dark Deception, Monster Mortals. Uh, wait, are uh, throwing the developers? Yeah. Uh, the reason is because uh, of a dispute regarding the name of the game. The litigation is stated to have been stated to and uh, begin because the title of the game has the word monsters as a part of the title. This isn't the first time Monster Energy has sued developers for extremely petty reasons. Mind you, the company has been known for extremely overzealous with its trademark. In fact, Immortals Phoenix Rising owes its current uh, name to Monster, claiming that Immortals, Gods, and Monsters would be confused with the brand. I think that was the main thing as well. It's something about confusing thing with brand, like... Additionally, the brand's lawyers are also for... Or wait. Lawyers are also known for targeting smaller game studios and making them go bankrupt, as stated by Glowstick Entertainment, developer of Dark Deception Monsters and Mortal CEO, Linsen's Livings. And this is why he had to say and all that. Uh, additionally, Vincent's life settlement terms for the lawsuit and broad strokes. Monster Energy demands that if Glow 6 Entertainment wants to continue using Dark Deception Monsters and uh, Mortals uh, moniker, they'll have to never name any other game any variation of the word monster. Additionally, the indie studio will be forced to agree to never use a green and white logo on a black background for any game. Where's the green? Where's the green? Um, fight back. Lay a green logo and then the game and also take control over the monsters and mortals logo, among other ridiculous uh, demands. So basically, it's just fucking stupid. The legal team got bored and they're just suing people for no reason. It reminds me of fucking Take Two uh, fucking behavior, honestly. The uh, uh, parent company to Rockstar Games, Take Two. They're dickheads and upon themselves as well. They were uh, also trying to sue, I think it was, It Takes Two. Even though, again, it do it's, it, like, why? It doesn't sound like you, like. Guys, I'm going to be changing my name from now on. I mean, it makes it sound like it does there, yeah, actually. I'm not going to lie. That, that, that's kind of a sus thumbnail. Just Markiplier and Lab Grown Meat by Char Moist Charlie Clips. Wait, are you telling me we can consume Markiplier? That'd be fucking strange. No, obviously it's not on about that. It's just the two topics together is saying. Lab Grown Meat is going to be interesting now. If that ever actually becomes a thing. Oh my god, I'm undershooting it.
after all that effort by jumping up as well, and I just do that, like... Try to pad out the run time. Um, I think people can tell the difference between Take 2 and 2K, and It Takes 2 as well, like... Because It Takes 2 is like... I don't know. Oh wait, what? Wh where are you going?! Oh no, especially monsters thing is just fucking stupid. It's like, oh damn, I bought the wrong monster, no way. Like, I bought this game on Steam and not the actual, like, energy drink can, no way. It's actually so stupid, like. I feel like that's a stretch. I mean, that's how I remember, like, uh, somebody mentioning it before, and how they probably see it, like... Or are trying to say that they see it. It's not like you can actually buy Monster Energy Drink off of Steam, so, like, it's just stupid, like... I smell something. PC, is it your time? Nah. Actually, a bit of an update on the PC shop that I went to before to buy my new mouse. Their PCs are just not, like, they're not powerful enough to replace my one. Like, even their highest, like, cost PC of 1,600, it's just like, bro, I literally could just probably, like, buy all those parts for less than 800, like. Eh, uh, what PCs? It's a, just a PC shop uh, that's, like, near my workplace. And, like, they make, like, custom-made PCs. But their PCs are just not as powerful as my one. I think, anyway, if I've done the searching right. And even if it was, it wouldn't be really worth the price anyway. They do, like, what they do just, like, online. Where it's, like, you have to pay, like, a lot for it. Oh, God. Um, where, honestly, I'd just rather would just make a new PC from scratch. Even if it meant just, like, looking up a video, I probably will just have to do that eventually if I ever want a new PC. It's just, like, actually look at, like, a guide online like my friend showed me before. Oh my god, I'm just fucking... Hold on. Oh. Oh. That's some cracks in my arms. Hold on, let, let me just do... Let me do my daily uh, wall squat because, like, I've been too lazy to exercise properly. Oh, there we go. Oh, I can't slide up because I don't have the shirt on. There we go. I'll turn this around. Around the world, around the world, around the world. Am I lined up? I think I'm good. Yeah. Beh. I don't know. I just thought, like, if there was actually a good PC there, that I might as well just buy it whilst it's physically there in person. So I don't want to have to wait a while. But at the same time, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to fork out 1,600 for a PC that's not even as powerful as my current one. Like, Oh, hi, babe. Or a ghost, should I say. My friend goes to a place called uh, Micro Center. They sell parts. Yeah, we wouldn't have something like that in Ireland, I don't think. The like closest shop I would think of, well, not the closest physically to me, but the closest example of a shop that would sell PC parts is like the sex shop, like CEX. But even then, they price like the shit out of their items, like. Last time I was in there, like probably last year or whatever, like they were selling PS5 for like 700 euro, like. So I wouldn't really trust them. Like even though I'm thinking about like bringing in old Xbox games soon, I'm just gonna regret it because like they're probably gonna give me literally like two cents for like all the games I have, like. But yeah, anytime when PC stuff is involved, I have to get it online. I don't even think I can get thermo paste in person either. Like, I remember I ordered it online. Still haven't used it yet, though. Too scared to, like, break the computer, you know? It's like, the moment I get a new PC, then I'll actually think about, per like, putting in a uh, new thermo paste. 
My cousin has uh, 40 90. Is that good? I think it is good, isn't it? I can't remember. I'd have to boot up Minecraft. Actually, I could just... I have, like, the PC parts, like, a link to it still. Oh, I could use that at some point. Basically, anyway, like, my PC's good enough as it is. It's just when a new game comes out, you can see sometimes on stream that I'll struggle to, like... I run it, I just turn everything to low graphics and even go into PNG mode just to be able to run the game, like... It's a lot more powerful than my PC. Well, that part, yeah. Oh, shit. Uh, I'll just go this way. There we go. But, uh, yeah. Other than that, like, a, well, I said new phone, but... There was a phone on my radar as well at one point, but at the same time, I've just decided, you know what? Until my actual phone dies, I don't really think there's a reason for me to buy a new one. Because, like, every phone I've had in the last, like, probably half a decade have been just Christmas presents or birthday presents, to be honest. I just never see the reason to upgrade my phone, really. And sure, I'm missing out on playing certain games, but maybe it's for the better, you know? Maybe it's for the better I don't get to play Genjin Impact everywhere I go, like. Um... Yeah, I'm kind of at a standstill with like, because like, I've saved up, I'm not going to disclose the amount of money, but I've saved up like the same amount of money I had before I went to America. And I'm just in this like mode now where I'm like, shit, I could spend this if I wanted to, but I just don't know what to spend it on. Like sure, food is like first thing, but like I'm not really going to go out of my way right now and just start <laughs> like splurging on food, but... It's so literally the only thing I can spend money on without worrying about it, because, like, yeah, it's food. Like, obviously I'd want this, like, as long as I'm not spending ridiculous monies on food, like. Especially if it's, like, a once-off experience as well. Like, when me and my mate go to Dublin those few times just to try out various bits and bobs. I won't need to upgrade, or sorry, I, yeah, uh, I won't need to upgrade my PC anytime soon. Why are you going for another... Uh, Compete like PC entirely, or like what's the story with yours? Because I do feel like maybe there's a potential I could upgrade some parts of my computer, but I'm also just lazy and I just buy the whole computer again. Or you know, any PC um, people watching this, maybe you want a VTuber to represent your brand? Yeah, no, maybe potentially. <laughs> but we can't do it here on Twitch. We, Twitch will be very angry if I'm advertising you, so I'm gonna have to move to a different platform for that. I'll advertise you in the, um, videos. Have it be, uh... Add in the, uh, edited version of the video. Oh, that reminds me, I need to fucking edit the, um... Other Backrooms video that I chopped down. Because I made one ages ago, and I made part two, but, like, I haven't edited it in a while. Oh god. Just give me a minute. I don't think I will need, uh... Oh, you know, you said that, didn't you? So I won't need... I don't think I will need to upgrade it. Oh, because, yeah, no, your parts are just good enough to run what you want, yeah. Is that what you mean by it? That's fair. Because I'm at this stage where, like, I feel like at some point I do need to upgrade it just so I can actually start playing uh, more, like, modern games and stuff. Oh, I think it's this way. Okay, no, I've been on the screen... Oh, sh shakalaka. Okay, just give me a minute. This is new territory I'm retreading. Oh my god. <clears throat> the intelligence of this being is uh, very low. Oh, you actually are so intelligent, Joe. Oh, you haven't had any, yeah. Like, upgrading would be, like, buying a new car. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair, though. Like, if you have had no issues with your PC, then you're good. I think it's because I push my, th like, PC to the fucking maximum. Like, I actually will just play a game, record stuff, and do other shit all on the PC. Like, there's rarely a moment where I'm not on my PC doing something. Like, I'll even multitask with my phone to take off some of, like, the, the load off my computer. But not intentionally, there's sometimes on the phone there's just, like, 
things that the PC doesn't have, like a game. Oh my god. Yeah, I'll be listening to videos and playing games and be writing Sherry Albert's story and also, like, listening to music at the same time and... Because, like, I'm running the VTuber model, that's the other thing I was thinking about. I'm running the VTuber model at the same time. Literally, PC abuse, yeah. Like, because of the VTuber model, I've pushed this PC to a good end, like... But if anything, technically I could just turn on my old computer, transfer what I can of OBS onto the, like, old computer, and then just start, like, streaming through that instead. Because I think that would actually take a load off of this computer, but at the same time it would be too much of an effort to, like, set up that old computer and have my current computer running at the same time. And I literally just don't have the desk space for it as well. You could have two PC running. Yeah, no, that's why I was literally just saying there. But that's the problem, though. I just don't have the room for it. So that's why I stick on the one uh, PC. Maybe if I move house, I'll get a desk that's actually big enough to, like, hold the... Uh... Oh, what am I doing? I'm doing that shit again. Maybe I'll have, like, an actual, like, desk that's big enough to hold all of it together, like... Maybe even have a little laptop on the side just for chat, like... But no, I prefer chat in the OBS itself so I can just, like, see it all together. I don't like things to be too, uh, segmented, like... Even though I know some Twitch streamers literally just have, like, a vertical monitor just to show all of chat... ...to themselves, but, yeah. I live in my house, lol. I right, sure, I'll just uh, casually get an American visa, like, and we'll go from there. Um, oh, that's what I'm doing, yeah. That's why I keep going overboard. Oh, there we go. In one of these runs, I hopefully will make some progress. As I was saying, hopefully I'll make some progress. you know that I am not good at the game. However, that does not stop me from improving in the game. Not like this. Uh, what would you do to for work in America? Like, is there any jobs that would interest you? Not really, to be honest. America kind of scares me, to be honest. Like, you literally could go on holiday and leave the country, no bother, but then trying to get back in is like a pain in the ass, like. Um, whatchamacallit, I'm kind of just, I'm happy in a sense, well actually, I'm not entirely happy, but, like, I'm comfortable enough where I am, honestly. Oh shit, there I go, to the bog. I don't think I'll move country for a job anytime soon. Unless Sherry Arbor's story takes off and some, like, uh, fucking manga company wants to make a, what should we call it, manga of Sherry Arbor's story and they're like, oh, you can move to Japan and make things easier. It's like, yeah. But even though, like, fucking, uh, I would, like, have to get over, well, I'd actually have to learn Japanese for a start and that'd be, a, like, I just can't learn languages. Like, I can barely speak English as it is, like, and even Japan, I think Japan actually would be a lot more stressful than thing than America just because of the whole language barrier. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> border patrol is strong. It really is. Even when just going on there on holiday, like, we literally had to pay America to fucking, like, say we wouldn't do this, that, and the other. Like, it's fucking mad. We basically had to pay for, like, I think it was, like, temporary visas or some shit like that. It's like, wait, you're telling me I have to pay for the flight, pay for shit in America, and I also have to pay just to be around in the country? Bruh. Shit, wait. Just give me a minute, I'm gonna get up here. Uh, Japanese work culture is different. Oh, no, Jap- I'd hate to get into Japanese work culture. I just hear bad shit about it. It's very, like- it consumes your life. I know, like, that's 
ironic for me to say because legit YouTube and the internet consume my life. But like, <laughs> Japanese jobs actually consume your life. You have, when you're done work, you sleep. <laughs> you don't have time to play around with your kids and like, you know, like hug your wife or whatever. Like, you're just straight to sleep. Depending on the job, like, depending what you're doing, and depending how hard you go in at work, like. It is fucking rough. As far as I've heard, anyway. But yeah. I'd rather go to the, like... I'd rather do what PewDiePie's doing now. Just, like, be basically just online doing shit. And then that's, like, my job covered, and then just live in the country. But even then, again, as I said, it's just be too stressful for me. I'd have to move with someone to, like, a country where I don't speak the language. So at least I have somebody to, like, back up on, like. And then we could both learn the language together and go from there. Even though I did have this kind of funny mindset recently where I'm like, you know, fuck it, why don't I just, like, go to Spain by myself randomly? <laughs> I just, like, completely just don't learn the language, be it, like, a very typical tourist and just try to survive before, like, the, like, holiday time is up, like. Um, whatchamacallit. I never went outside of USA, so I don't know what, uh, it's like going in and out. You know, I heard, though, like, even as an American... Like, when you leave, it's fine. They don't really bother to check for anything. But once you come back, they're fucking, like, they scan you, like, fucking madly. It's, it's very strange. Or they're very strict, should I say. Like, the TSA and all that. But if you ever find yourself in that opportunity to go abroad, and, like, you know it's financially doable as well. You should definitely do it, like. Because, like, it started, I think, when I was 17. And, um, we went to the UK for, like, football matches. But even then, that was, like, damn, I don't think I'm going to do any better than this, like, in my recent life. Or in my current, like, uh, life after school. But then fucking, f uh, fast, uh, yeah, fast forward. <coughs> To 2022, so like uh, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So like five years later, literally flies to America with my mate for the first time without any family members. Like, it's just mad. Oh my god, at least we had um, you and your sister to see. So like, at least we were meeting up with someone, but yeah. Um, well, they want to make sure you don't bring back spyware or legal uh, something. Technically, other countries do that as well, but not in the same... Well, I mean, what I mean about them being strict is not really in the kind of airport security kind of thing. Because every airport is secure to a certain degree. Like, you can't get on the plane. If you have certain things, you can't have liquids and all that sort of shit. But what I mean is, like, when we were going there initially, I almost didn't, like, get onto the plane because the TSA member was asking us, like, why we were visiting America in the first place. And we said we were there to see your sister. But then, like, fucking, um, whatchamacallit. Uh, they were like, oh, have you ever met this person before? I was like, oh, no, we haven't. And then it's like, oh, then why are you, like, how are you, or how do you know each other and all that? And, like, I could tell by their tone, they had to fucking be hard on me. Because, like, I was acting suspicious. Uh, but then I was like, oh, yeah, no, just through the internet and Discord. So thank God they fucking... Like, just let me off on that, like... I should have been more obvious, or more, uh, thing. Just be like, oh yeah, no, on I just know them from online, like... I do know, though, a lot of, um, TSA members really don't want to do what they do, but they know they have to anyway. Like, I remember at one point, someone, like, a TSA member actually apologized to someone as they were passing through the gate. Um, which just goes to show, they're, like, people as well. They're just doing their job, you know? But, yeah, sorry, I'll read what you're saying now. I'd like to go, um, Japan, Korea, Africa, Ireland, Paris. Just say we meet on dating websites. <laughs> uh, I mean, it, just even saying you met them online is honestly enough, like. I just specifically said Discord, because that's where we did actually meet. And that's where Brando met her as well. Um... 
I think I have a friend that's going to Paris next year. Uh, man, Ireland, I wonder what I wonder what's like to visit that place, man. That'd be mad. Um But you know, if you or your sister ever come over, we definitely would like me and my mate, like, would definitely like uh try to make time to greet you and all that and try to take you around if we can with like what we with you know what we can actually use because like unlike your sister like we can't drive because we don't have like driving licenses as of right now so like we'd have to rely a lot on buses like to get around the place so i'd say our main destination would literally just be like dublin and we just yeah go from there like um my like i know brando met her on Discord, but I can't remember all the details. And then it was just like one day when him and her were, I think, just in a party or something. He was like, oh no, Joe, yeah, if you want to join us in the party, you can. I was like, oh yeah, I will. And then we kind of just went from there and we played a bunch of Faz and yeah. Um, what was I mentioned before? Korea would be an interesting place to go to as well. Africa, maybe. I'm not sure. And obviously, Japan is on my radar. Like, I even jokingly mentioned it once, but it's like, I think it's like, um, from Ireland, it's like 1,000 odd quid just to get there. Like, maybe 900 to 800 euro, like, just for one person to go two way. Which is quite a bit. Why am I doing this? Just give me a minute. I'm going to see if I can actually get out of bog for a minute. Like,. Um, uh, where am I reading from? Oh, yeah, I I met someone who lives in California. We me playing, uh, all playing Overwatch. I feel sorry for you. No, but like honestly, if your friends that like go beyond Overwatch, then like that is a nice sign, honestly. But me myself, like as I mentioned before, like I I don't even have like the Blizzard launcher downloaded anymore. I'm actually, like, completely done with Overwatch. I'm probably never going to touch the game again, to be honest. Like, not only do people I know not really play it anymore, but, like, I'm not really interested in playing it anymore anyway. Especially after how Overwatch 2 went, so... Um... Oh, yeah, you just play Diablo 2, yeah. That's cool. Which part? Sorry, this fucking music. Turn down on my headset, like. Um. Yeah, can't remember what else I was gonna mention, honestly. I'm just so, like, focused on the game, like, that I'm forgetting stuff probably a lot easier because of it. Shit. Uh, we played with his girlfriend. I played with his girlfriend, yeah. It's cool, like, the people you're gonna meet online. Like, honestly, I've been kind of tempted to get back into playing, like, um, Destiny Raids and Dungeons again with people. Just to see, like, who's on and all that, you know? But I just haven't given myself enough time to do it. I just do too much other stuff to... be social like that. Excuse me. Even though I wish I was more social. Even, like, with my increased confidence, like... I feel like if I'm wasting people's time, then I just feel like a dickhead, like. Especially when it comes to dungeons and raids and destiny. Even though, like, for the most part, I know what I'm doing. It's just like... I don't know. Like, I will say, though, I'm, I'm like that fucking, like, cog in the machine in a raid where, like, I will actually function as intended, like, basically 98% of the time. There's only a rare amount of time that I'll fuck up because, like, I'm usually put on a job that's not too difficult to do. Or that I already know the ins and outs of, like. Um, but yeah. Maybe I should do that at some point, just to change up the streams a little bit. Do a bit of a Destiny raid or something like that. But obviously I'd have to have the thing muted, because you never know what anybody's going to spout out at any moment, like, and I don't want to be banned off Twitch, like. <laughs> like, to tell the truth. Uh, pool stream. I did do a hot tub stream not too long ago, but obviously it wasn't a social one. It was literally just... It was just this down here. I'll just show it briefly. It was this joke here. <laughs> um, but yeah. I still have it there because, like, 
I put so much effort into making it, I, I, I don't have the heart to delete it yet. I kind of want to just wait, just in case. Oh my god. Even though I know I'm not going to do another hot tub stream in a while. Because I think I've, like, um, benched it. Like, benched a follow goal, so, yeah. Is that a dog or a bike? I think it was a bike. I just heard screech there. Yeah, it's a bike. Um... I think, oh no, yeah, no. I was going to say I think Twitch are introducing a good new thing, but, I mean, it might be a good new thing, because they're introducing a kind of, like, chat service now for, like, content creators who want to, like, reach out to someone about their problems and stuff, which is like, wait, did they not have that before? But then again, that's better than YouTube, because I swear with YouTube, it's like, oh, you tweet towards them, but they say fuck off, basically, like... Just like before when, like, a video of mine got, like, removed, and, like, I was trying to ask them, like, hey, like, I know this probably should be removed, could, but can you at least tell me why? But they just said nothing. But then again, if every time you, like, removed a video from a platform or banned someone and had to give a reason why, like, the process would just take too long, like... Is it kind of weird that I thought about, like, taking, like, a part of my workplace, like, what we do at my workplace, and making it into my own kind of little shop? It's <laughs> just, like, legit just, like, just yoink something from my workplace, like, the idea of it, and just, like, use it for my own. I mean, that's how places innovate, right? Maybe it's the start of me owning my own shop, and I would just not have the money for that. I don't even think a bank would even trust me with a loan, like, to be honest, like... I don't even, like, use my, um, bank card that often. I use my, uh, other one for online shopping and stuff. I know Discord going to have something where they're going to have subscription for private channels. Yeah. Yeah. It's <laughs> just, yeah. My brains are, or my brain cells are mushy. My brain is, like, already sick of this loop I'm in, honestly. And I would like to do a little bit of Destiny fishing, but at the same time, I've already done the fishing I need to for this week, so... I'm not really bothered to do any more of it. And I know there's a new weekly quest where you just keep fishing and get good stuff, but, like... Stuff in Destiny isn't really... Like, good stuff to me is, like, the experiences now. Like, the experiences I'm still missing out on in-game. That's why, like, I've been doing those little bits of fishing to try and get the progress on the exotic quests. And why I keep saying I want to do dungeons and raids. I want to get back into those experiences because they're pretty nice. I literally have friends as well that I can reach out for. I don't even have to just go into LFG, but, yeah. Again, hopefully, like, in a year's time when, like, um, the final shape comes out that I don't actually, like, buy it. And I actually just wait for it to come out and see what it's like. Because, honestly, if it's a really shit DLC somehow, even though it's, like, the finale of, like, the Light and Dark Saga of Destiny 2, then that's gonna really rub people, like, the wrong way and the Destiny franchise could actually die. It'd be such a shame, though, for the franchise to die on its, like, last DLC, but... It is how it is. I actually wouldn't even be surprised if they're trying to cook up like two DLCs right now for Destiny. They have like a DLC, like the Final Shape DLC, and then they have another DLC for like the um, start of the new saga or some shit. Even though I kind of hope they just make Destiny 3 at this point with the amount of issues Destiny 2 has, but anyway. Um, you have friends, wow, I know, it's bad. Uh, so does Destiny have- uh, Destiny has endings, but like, they're not permanent endings. Like, the game itself will never end because it's a live service game. Like, unless Destiny, like, makes Bungie no money anymore, they're not gonna finish, like, with the Destiny franchise. And I think, like, even if the game does die, they're still gonna try and bring it back somehow. 
Unless Marathon or the new game, like, codename Matter, like, does better, then, yeah, Destiny is still, uh, Bungie's, uh, cash cow. Um, what you were asking as well, um, uh, does it have a battle pass? Unfortunately, yeah, it does have a battle pass. Which, actually, there's recent bullshit that came around that, right? Where, like, um, Destiny's pass doesn't give you premium currency. But it was only 10 quid, and you actually would get access to seasonal content as well. So that's pretty cool, right? You get access to a load of stuff like that. That's fine. But recently, because of quote-unquote inflation, they've had to raise the price of the season pass to $12. Or 12, uh, 1,200 silver, sorry. It's 10,000 silver initially. Or 1,100, should I say. Um, but now that's 1,200 silver, if you go into the um, like DLCs for Destiny and try and buy silver, you'll realize that you can only buy 50, like a 15 euro bundle if you want to be able to buy the season separately now. Which is just massive bullshit, like. And at the same time, um, if you really wanted to be as close as you can to 1,200, you'd have to get uh, the 10 euro bundle, which is like 1,100. Which is again, just bullshit. I don't, I feel like they raised it, like the price, like hopefully they do actually provide a bit more content and not just say, oh inflation and then just raise the price of the content for the same shit they've been doing like for so long, like. I feel like the, the Sony like acquisition of Bungie is, like was a bad idea. I'm just gonna say that. Like I think even at first I was saying, like maybe at first I remember a TikTok I was looking at recently of myself. I was like, what? How? But, like, in a good way or something like that. But now I just see it as a bad thing. Anytime Bungie tries to fucking, like, get with a studio, it always goes wrong. And this is probably signs of it going wrong. Because as, um, as the Cross recently put out a video, like, Destiny 2 is microtransaction hell. With the way they monetize the game and shit. And part of that could be attributed to, like, fucking Sony's acquisition of Bungie, like... Because, you know, if you're paid a certain amount of money to do what you do, then you want to prove to them that, you know, you can do what you do and still earn a lot more, like... Yeah, um... What was it called? Does it have a... Or so, it's like EOS. What's EOS? Is that... That's not Echo of Souls, is it? So I think I might have played that once when I was, like, wee young now. Bad young now. I was a wee lad now. But that's ancient history to me. El oh, Elder Scrolls Online. No, I haven't played that. I'm not sure, though. All I know is, like, um... It's a bad thing, in a sense, for me. I don't know, I just... I've given up on liking the way Destiny is. I kind of do wish, like, Destiny was more of a uh, traditional game, where it's, like... You know, they would, like, uh, release the game in full, fixed and fully polished. And then, you know, two to three years later, release the same, well, not the same game, but, like, the sequel to the game. I wish they just went back to that sort of shit. Maybe Bungie should still be owned by Activision. They blame Activision for, like, the way they were doing shit, but honestly, Activision kind of kept Bungie in line, honestly. <laughs> like, unironically, well, Activision was actually a good thing that happened to, like, Destiny, <laughs> like... I'm looking back on it now. But, yeah... It would be ESO. Oh, yeah, yeah. God, come on, I need to take a sip. I think I'm a little lightheaded from the amount of talking I'm doing. Oh. But yeah, uh, hopefully with Lightfall when that comes out, I'll finally break myself from the cycle. So I kind of, like, even though it is, like, a, like the gameplay of Destiny is really fucking good, like, and as somebody said before, people are still crutching on Destiny because of the fact it's a really nice shooter to play because it just feels nice. But man, like, oh, I just, I just kind of want to leave, like, I kind of just, I want to just, like, watch videos on Destiny for, like, in the future, but... I've already put in my 100 euros for the year, so, well, not under 100 euros, should I say. 
So I'm here until life fall now. And obviously I'm still gonna like play the game in the meantime because that means I have this battle pass and like two more battle passes to fill out before the uh, final shape. I don't know, part of me has big hopes that they would do this, that and the other, but as I've mentioned before, if they made DLCs free, then they would probably be shit. I don't think they'd ever release another good DLC ever again, because it's free. And an example of why, like, free content doesn't do well in Destiny is just, like, like, even just playing the New Light experience and thinking back on it, it's not really that good. And then other free content in the game, like Crucible, like the PvP, is just in a bad state right now because it's free, it's not Bungie's focus, like. And the PvE is, like, subjective if it's good or not, but I feel like it's good enough anyway. And, like, that is good because you are paying for it. Like, you're paying, like, what is it, 40 for DLC and 10 per season. Like, you, they'd want to make it good so that you're actually doing thing, like. And at the same time, there is that. But, like, if they ever went into a more free-to-play mindset for everything in the game, then that'd be disastrous. Because then, like... Like, they just depend on Eververse for cosmetic stuff. And they'd always put shit in, like, the battle passes make the DLC shit, the season shit. Like, anything free in the game would just be shit. That's why, like, Bungie still, like, like, dilute the fucking Eververse store up so much, because it fucking does, like, it does wonders for them. Why spend, like, so much resources on, like, a 40, like, euro DLC? When you could literally do the same thing for armor sets, but charge, like, 20 per armor set. Less work, but more money. Oh shit, how did I make it up here? <laughs> I don't even know what I just did! Uh, the only things I don't like in games are battle passes and microtransactions. Yeah, Bungie unfortunately has both of them, and uh, they're also kind of pay to win now, because, um... They have this yoke in the game called, um... Hold on, let me try this real quick. No. They have these things in game now called Deep Sight Resonance uh, or Deep Deep Sight Harmonizers. If you get five of them, you can basically like if a weapon was craftable before, you can craft it like just by basically paying a hundred to unlock everything in the battle pass. And um, the problem with that is right, you could craft like the god roll weapon that you want on day one as long as you grind out levels for that weapon. And that's a new big problem in the community, and that's why we're at a boiling point once again. But I guarantee everything is going to be fixed. It, it happens every fucking year with Bungie. Shit happens, shit hit the fan. Next season, shit starts getting good. Last season, shit's amazing. Next DLC, it's shit. Then it starts to cycle again. It happens, I've been playing Destiny for nearly a decade. I know what the fuck's going to happen next, like... But then again, now I have to answer, like, why I'm even still here, like. Oh, shit. I don't know how to make it up here efficiently. Okay, there we go. So, now I need to go here. Oh, see, I can... No, I can reach that, but it's just of what... Hello? Brain cells? Where did you go? That is madness. Where the fuck did I go? I just seen that there, just give me a minute. I'm gonna make it back up. Uh, also, Epic exclusive games on the store. Yeah, Epic do have like limited time exclusivity on certain items. I do know though, when they were giving away Destiny, they actually gave away the 30th anniversary pack for free. That was nice. Now, if only if they did that with all the old DLC instead of charge fucking full price for every old DLC that exists, like. But then again, if every DLC was free, then Bungie would be like, Oh, sun setting's back. I'm going to take all that content away soon. Because that's what they essentially did with, like, Forsaken. They, like, made the campaign free and then it, like, got sunset, quote-unquote. Basically removed from the game. And honestly, that con whole content vaulting debate is really bitten them in the ass right now. Because, like... Now that, like, the game is, like, has content removed from it, it's fucked around with a lot of the parts of the game. 
Which is why it's so unstable right now. Oh, please don't. Don't do this to me. Don't honk your horn, please. Because even if I close the window, it doesn't matter if I'm still... Or if I close the window, it's still gonna be noise. I just don't like noise anymore. I'm already at that age where I'm gonna live in the countryside, but I don't at the same time, because then I wouldn't have good Wi-Fi. Country roads, take me home. But, and I think another thing that annoys me about Bungie as well, is I think it was like their director or some shit that came out ages ago in a like panel thing for like developers talk about the live service model and they were just like um and uh, never over deliver or some shit like that because if you over deliver expectations are raised and then people will like get disappointed but honestly i think i'd rather be like um i'd rather have like i, w I would rather be over delivered than under delivered even if it's well i'd rather be over delivered sometimes than no times because when Bungie, like, hit, they hit hard. Like, Witch Queen was just banging. Witch Queen was good. And now they're telling us they don't want to do that again, but... You never know. Hopefully Life Fall is really good, because, again, it is, like, meant to be the final DLC of the uh, saga, but... At the same time, time will tell. I won't pre-order it. Unless something happens in the future, and I have to, like, get it for some reason, like... Maybe I finally get a girlfriend and she's really into Destiny. Then it's like, fuck, well, I guess I have to know. We both have a crippling uh, debt together. Oh, I'm gonna check the Epic Game Store. <laughs> fuck this. I'm, I'm done. Nah, I'm not completely done with Destiny. Or Destiny with uh, Jump King. I'm just. Oh, I'm just getting frustrated, honestly. Again, I wish I could just go fishing and thing, but it's not really much point. Can I move the Epic Game Store, please? I hate the way they load the window. They don't allow you to move it for a bit. There we go. Uh, did you see they put Metal Gear Collection on Steam? Was it not on Steam before? That's good though, because that's a that's a way of preserving the game. If it was only on like consoles before. Let's see what have we got for this? No, if it loads anytime soon. Ah. Ugh. I think it's ninety bucks. Honestly, depending on which games you get, it might be decent, but. I don't know. I, I can't gauge the value because I don't think I've played all the Metal Gears. The only one I've played is Metal Gear Revengeance. Like, the standing here, I realize you are just... Are people still mad about Hogwarts Legacy? Can I play the game now? <laughs> I swear that was a game I was going to play in my own time ages ago, but because of the controversy surrounding it at the start of the year, I just didn't. Probably should, but yeah. I'll probably get, like, Game Pass or something at some point and then play it through that. The Dungeon of Nahul Puke. The Amulet of Chaos. And then Grime is the other free game. And then there's, like, a whole tab just for Fortnite. 60 bucks, my bad. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty decent, then. Uh, contains content under rate. Is un that is unrated and may not be appropriate for all ages. Then why do they make it free if they're sure of that? If it's unrated. Update available. I'm not updating now. Okay, what game do we even have here? Is it top down? Eh. Not really my type of game, but... I'll da well, not download it, but I'll save it anyway. I might as well, like... There's no harm in just, uh... Whatchamacallit, just, like, having it. Has blocked some features as app. Why? No, allow. It's li Windows, calm down. It's literally epic just like accepting a game. Like, well, not even purchase, but claim. Like, uh, continue browsing. Yeah, continue browsing because I don't really want to download it. But that's the second time my firewall has tripped. Like, because I think yesterday a trip when Opera was doing shit. 
Windows or Microsoft must have updated their terms or some shit to include or include certain things. Okay, right now this time for sure I'm actually gonna make progress. It's gonna be fucking gas when I do this. Beholder two is free on Gog. Oh, that's cool. Uh, Gog then say choice matters, and then the asterisk because of the uh, link. Oh, why did I bounce that way? Why do I, bro? My head. I think it's because it's been a while since I've done this. My head is like starting to spin a little, like. Well, not spin, but like thing. Link delisted law. <laughs> But yeah, Twitch don't allow it, well not allow, it's not Twitch themselves, but I've taken the option to not allow links and stuff because of past experiences. Because that's all I'd ever get when I was a smaller stream, well I say smaller streamer, still a small streamer now. But I mean small relative to now. Where like, it's just constant people fucking, like advertising their shit and whatnot, and you just, ugh, I hate it so much. Even though I do kind of deserve it for giving myself a shout out on a mate stream that had like a hundred views. <laughs> yeah, no, that that is like karma for me, and it'll continue to haunt me. Because even on like Brando stream before, he was just randomly streaming a game, and some random like account, like a bot, was just like commenting about get free followers here at this link, and um, I don't think they pasted in the link right because they left a space on purpose in case the link got blocked. But even then. Like, I was there at the time, and I was like, I hope he doesn't mind I do this, but I'm gonna just block this person, like. Because he doesn't need to deal with this sort of shit whilst he's live, like. Because I hate dealing with that sort of shit as well. That's why I have the rules back down again. And I do update it every so often, just to make sure people know, yeah, please, don't advertise your shit, thank you. Like, unless it naturally just comes out, like, in conversation where, like, I'm talking to a chatter that just happens to have a YouTube channel. That's fine. Because you're not intentionally doing it. Unless you are intentionally doing it and you're trying to, like, fool me, then if I find out, bro, you'll get timed out, you know? If you're a bot, you'll get banned instantly. If you're not a bot, then you'll get timed out. And then if you do a second time, you get banned. Um. Oh, shit. But, uh, yeah. Someone posted a porn link. I wouldn't even be fucking surprised, honestly. Just edit. Oh, shit. I mean, this is why I should be very cautious of that sort of stuff, you know? But I also don't want to go full fucking, like, um, Autobot mo Well, not Autobot. Yeah, no, auto mod bot mode. Where, like, anything anyone says is just scrutinized. So I remember before there was a period, or it was just a stream, should I say, where the um, auto mod bot, I, I was like, oh, let's see what it's like if I crank it up a little bit more. But then, like, that next stream, like, every, well, not everyone, but people were starting to get their shit already, like, marked. I was like, okay, this is a bit too strong even for me, like. So even now, actually, I'm gonna look at it in a second, but, like, my auto mod, um, whatchamacallit, it's only on, like, level one, I think. Whereas before, I put it on level two, and that's when it started causing trouble, like. Actually, no, I think it's various levels. It's, like, customized. Because obviously for like hateful slurs and stuff, I'd have that maxed out. But then for other stuff, it's like not as high. Especially where context matters, like, you know? Like, you know, let's say somebody's bullying me, uh, but we're having banter. Like, I don't want them to get flagged every two seconds because they're doing that, you know? We're just having banter. Um, whatchamacallit. I wouldn't like, uh, I, I wouldn't be like, hey, go check out my holy fans. I did make an account, but I don't plan on posting there. <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. I can't remember if I have, like, um... I can't remember if I have, like, a OnlyFans account for X reason. I wouldn't be to buy some of these OnlyFans. I think I was actually going to joke around and do my own OnlyFans kind of thing. Um... God damn it. Sorry, I had to add that because it's thumbnail. I'm not touching grass. That's where ants sex. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna check my auto mod for a minute here. Just one second. Oh, that, oh so this is what you see now. Joseph Blair's content is intended for certain uh, audiences. It may contain slight or significant profanity or vul 
or a vulgarity sexual themes. This content may not be appropriate for you to watch. That is mad. I don't know if that like deters a lot of people from watching the stream, honestly, because it is kind of a border into the stream, but eh, fair to be safe than sorry. Maybe one day I'll take it off because there's not really any need for, eh, for that all the time. Because sometimes shit just happens during streams and sometimes a warning isn't always enough. Or it's not necessary, should I say. Um, 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 channel and videos, is it here? I think it's here somewhere. Community. Analytics content. Settings. Moderation. There it is. Auto mod rule sets. Oh, there's a lot more options. Swearing. There's. Okay. I will actually read all this out what's allowed and what's not allowed, but yeah. Maybe I might increase that a little bit. There you go. And there's always like safe mode anyway. For um whatchamacallit. Or a safe shield or no shield mode. There we go. Shield mode. Where it's like chat will be cleared and any settings selected in shield mode will immediately be activated. So I'm not gonna do that because I never really have to. But that was handy during I think they only added that shield option because of the fucking Hogwarts legacy uh, controversy at the time. Um, yeah, right, anyway. Try to think if there's something I want to do before I keep playing. You know, actually, when I get something to eat in a second, let me just uh, play the break and go there. The <laughs> emoji mode, yeah. yeah. Just, if I never want to hear anybody's opinions ever again, just emoji mode. <laughs> yeah, but just BRB. How convenient where it's just like, and no, I didn't have my mic muted. I swear, I swear. I'm sorry. Look, okay, look, at least I saw it immediately. I was like, oh yeah, I need to turn this on. Anyway. What are you doing, mate? What are you doing? Damn those cheeks, though! Damn! The physics! Three. Two. One. It, it's happened. It, it, it's happened. We're finally here. I am now a maid. If you talk about the, um, whatchamacallit, the thingy charity calendar, I didn't actually buy it. And if he has an OnlyFans, I haven't bought it. Yet. But yeah. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, fine lab, I'll show you again. Look, look, right, pay attention. Ah, <laughs> it's so weird, it's just, you transition to that and it's like similar. Right. Um, should probably take a swig of water first, but here we go. Ah, hydration. God, my ratio of, like, fucking jumps to falls is not even funny. It's so bad. Well, not even so bad, but it's just, like, so skewed. Damn. Kind of makes me want to pull out my calculator just to see, like... Some of the things here. Hold on a minute. Thirteen, four, two, three, divided by seven, nine, one. So that's a one to sixteen ratio. Ratio. No, sixteen to one ratio. Sorry. So that the jumps would be sixteen, and the falls would be one. Almost like seventeen to one. Damn, that's mad. That's completely bonkers, honestly. That's just bananas. Okay, when I get up here, I need to do s- Oh, for fuck's sake. Whenever I get back up there, I need to do something different. I'm obviously doing something wrong. Because I won't progress during this stream if I don't do it right, like... Dun, dun, dun.
I'm not finishing the sentence. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I have been like kind of re-watching some of my old content recently. Some of the shit I've said in videos is still actually kind of gas. My favorite moment is when I was raging in Cruise I'm just like, suck my cock. It just shows a chicken, like. Oh my god, for fuck's sake, I'm gonna fall down into bog and I'm gonna go all the way to the bottom, man. Oh. Javla fawn. And they, like, I do this shit on purpose as well, where it's like. We do a few jumps over until I can actually try to get out. Like. Honestly, saying Jaflafon like has actually just become so part of my like vocabulary. I don't even realize it. Like, it's a bit of Swedish for you. Vision is blurring now. Wait, <laughs> even my eyes have gotten fucking tired of this game now. Where like my vision is just blurring because it's like you don't really need to know any detail here to be honest. Like you're just doing the same shit over and over like I know. I really oh jeez, that scared the shit out of me. Uh thank you, Chad, for following us. Um watch my car, I'm just saying something. That's crazy. Oh, uh, have we got a fall guys uh, joking coming? Or am I just like uh, preemptively just being a dickhead for no reason? I'm sorry, I've heard it a few times before when I fr oh shit, when I was first playing Jump King, and even before like when I was listening to people play Jump King, like I heard like the same sort of shit. But yeah, what is crazy is that just my vision blurring when I'm just so like tired of doing the same section of the game over and over. Oh, for fuck's sake, why? Oh, what? I actually want to... Am I going to bring back the sentence? I don't really need to bring back the sentence, to be honest. Because for the part, like, since map 2, I've been mentioning I'll break my keyboard, but I really haven't. Or real... I will not do that. Only a certain requirement needs to be met for me to break my keyboard. I actually wouldn't even know... Wait. Would I really... I wonder if I actually... Because, okay, now I'm actually taking this phrase seriously. Would I actually break my keyboard after failing in Jump King? Because I think at this point, right, I know what I need to do in the game. So it's not a question of random things happen and then it just frustrates me to shit. It's more of just, like, me, myself messing up. So it's, like, hard for me to fucking, like, um... Whatchamacallit, it's hard for me to do thing. Oh, shit. Um... Yeah, I'm sorry by the way, Chad. I just- I, I feel like I kinda just rubbed off as a dickhead, like, instantly, like... This is what repeatedly doing the same sections and joking over and over does to you, like... You know you when you're hungry. Have a sneeze. Snicker bars are actually not even that bad, honestly. Like, I know when I was younger I didn't really like them, because, like, nuts equals bad, but, like, nuts aren't too bad. Except peanuts. I know it's blasphemous to say this, but I actually don't really... Like, I'm not allergic to them, but, like, it doesn't... 
bode well in my stomach, honestly, I don't think. I think that's mainly why. They don't taste that well for me enough for me to consider, like, actually, like, eating peanuts, like, outright. I mean, actually, no, there's a difference between eating peanut-flavored things and eating peanuts themselves. Oh, wait, why am I... <sighs> what do you call it? I think, um... Okay, I can't, I won't comment on normal peanuts, but peanut-flavored things, that's where it's like, eh, I don't know. So, unfortunately, then, I wouldn't really, like, Reese's, like, uh, isn't it Reese's Puffs? Not Puffs, because Puffs is the cereal. Or something like that. Reese's? No, Re yeah, no, Reese's. Yeah, no, that's the song is about the cereal, right? Reese's Puff, Reese's Puff. Beat em up, beat em up, beat em up, beat em up. Reese's Puff, Reese's Puff. Peanut butter chocolate flavor. Did you know Ethan Nestor has a very bad case of peanut allergy? If you even breathe in one direction with peanut breath towards him, then yeah, he'll die. Even if you're not in the same direction. Nah, I say he'll die, but like he'll have a bad reaction to it. Back to that argument about fucking breaking my keyboard. I don't think I actually will. I think the closest I've come to breaking my keyboard during these streams is literally when I picked it up and I twisted it just to test it, like how much force I'd need to give it before it snapped. I think that's the legitimate closest like I've been to breaking this keyboard properly. I mean, to be honest, actually, I wouldn't even be surprised if my mouse was broken with the amount of like slamming I was doing on my desk. And maybe I like was accidentally hitting my mouse and I didn't even realize it like because I was just constantly moving it around when I hit the desk well moving it whilst moving the keyboard yeah I probably wouldn't be able to rage that much I'm gonna say this now and jinx myself but I think my days of breaking stuff when I rage have like are past me now so I haven't I well to be fair I haven't had a controller in a long time so like I wouldn't really be able to test that theory, because that's the, probably like the last proper thing I broke. Uh, I'm not even angry. Yeah, I guess in anger, probably. Because other than that, the last thing I broke was like a <laughs> was a laptop charger from work, and I thought I was fucking boned because it's like the second week of me working, and it's like, oh shit, I literally just broke something in the workplace. That's gas. But no, my uh, manager was pretty chill about it, and they were like, oh yeah, no, that happens, like, uh, a lot with those older chargers, so don't worry about it, like. And plus, there's already, like, a bazillion copies of the chargers, so, like, I didn't really have to worry about much. Just my impression wasn't really that good. Like, first week, I gave good impressions for what I was doing, and then second week, I break a charger, like, not good impression. But even now, like, I'm solidifying myself. I think, for sure, like, I think I've talked about this before already, but I feel like once we hit the August mark, I think that's, like, the six-month mark, or around there, that's when I actually gotta, like, start considering maybe another workplace. Not that I don't like the workplace I work in now, but, like, <laughs> we gotta get into hustler's mindset, bros. We gotta start earning lots of money, bro. But then again, I'm also scared to like get a full-time job in case I can't dedicate any time anymore to streaming, making videos, Sherry Arbor Story, the light novel series I'm currently working on, and all that sort of stuff. And plus, like if I was to work at another place, it probably would be that place that I'm talking about that was close to me and it's got a bad reputation like. Like, sure, it'd be nicer to, like, wake up, early, like, later in the morning to get to work and, like, know that I'll be grand because I literally could just walk to work, but... It's... I don't know if it's worth the trade-off, though. Right now, it's worth the trade-off to, like, travel to work and get... Oh, hi, ghost. It's worth it traveling to work because I work in such a nice environment, like... Regardless of how the, um, environment is when I'm not there, that that's a different story. I won't ramble on too much about that. We just adapt anyway. We all just help each other out. 
I can't express how much, like, how genuine I am when I mean that, though. Like, my workplace is decent. Like, it's the only reason I probably, like, overwork, in a sense, as well. Is because, like, I know I'm not going to get any raise or bonus for it, but, like, I'm still doing it because I just like the workplace, like. And plus, when I'm at work, I like to do work, so, like, taking a break isn't, like, an easy thing for me to do. Unless I'm forcefully sat down with people and I have to talk to them, like, then I'll be like, okay, now I'll do it, like. But half the time we're so busy, like, you always need someone out and ready. The most I really need for a break anyway is, like, probably, like, five to ten minutes anyway. I don't really need the whole hour. I use it as leverage in the future anyway, like, if I ever need it. It's just like, oh, well, during most, like, breaks anyway, I never really take them anyway, so, you know, it is how it is. Like, even just, um, oh, God. Even, uh, oh, shit. Even this last week, I was, like, working. We we're meant to have, like, a little, like, five-minute break. Um, I think it's meant to be five. Actually, it might be a ten-minute break. But anyway, I was meant to have a break, but I just didn't because I was just so busy. And that just happens, but at the same time, I'm all right with that. I feel like whilst my other workmate is out and can't take a certain, like, take care of a certain section of the workplace, like, I gotta do that in their stead. I'll take it upon myself to try and keep it as organized as possible. Until they come back. And then they can take back over again, but, yeah. Anyway, Jump King. Such a good game, isn't it? I'm trying to think. Oh, actually, there is something else I could talk about in terms of news and stuff. When it comes to Sherry Arbor's story, well, I say Sherry Arbor's story, but it's more so, um, like for the channel rather than thing. But it does tie into Sherry Arbor's story. But the, um, the Hatsune Miku song, or the Hatsune Miku cover of the song made with uh, Shionovas and all them. That should be coming on along now, once we get more into July. I'll have more details, like, sooner, uh, soon after, when I can. It's just right now, like, I can't really do much. I've already done what I can now. And I have, like, the uh, cover of the song ready. It's just, like... Essentially, it's just doing one extra little bit that's just gonna take a bit of time. And then once that's done, I can get it out, and then I can probably start focusing again on trying to get a preview for uh, Volume 1 sorted. So I did say I wanted to do that ages ago now, but still haven't gotten around to it. I haven't even edited a little bit of Sherry Albert's story recently. Actually, that reminds me. Oh, come on. Bro, my hands are so slippery. There we go. Uh, this, 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 this one. For a few pee here. Actually, wouldn't that not like help out my PC a little bit? I know there's already a thing there, but what if I just like pull my desk a little bit this way? Like allow some of the heat to come up through the back of the monitors instead of just closing it off. Because that's where all the air goes anyway. It gets pushed back into the wall. Like, not really good positioning on my part, but like, hey, the wires have got to be plugged in, like, or else the PC no work. Other than that, actually, <laughs> the alternative job I could look forward to is just, like, do more kick streams and stuff. Oh, shit. Do more kick streams. <laughs> Finally get partner and go from there. You actual dumbass. You are the literal world's biggest laughing stock. Oh my god, up we go. There we go. Whew. Back into it. I feel like this section of the game right now is giving me that vibes of Wunderberg again. We're going to be seeing these three sections a lot, like. Especially with the next section, like above us, the one with all the fly shit all around, like. It's going to be a problem to get through that just because of, uh, whatchamacallit. 
because I'm stupid. There we go. That's, that's the easiest way to sum it up. I'm just dumb. But then again, you can't really expect me to just instantly solve everything. I wish I could do that, but unfortunately that's just not me. I don't have the brain capacity for that. You actual dumb... Ugh. I'm already tired. How long are we in? We're not even two hours into stream and I'm already tired. Like, just goes to show, like, what taking, uh... Well, not even taking time, just, like, not streaming does for you. changed my mind about that guy at the bottom so much. He's actually just pretty chill, honestly. A bit obsessive of his wife, but you know. I think I would be too if I actually had a partner. thing I will do because like it's not needed I know I said the thing about the 18 plus filter but I might actually just turn it off and just leave the guidelines one on because now that I think about it you're probably like bombarded with two different like uh things when you like go into the stream like uh let's see what do we got <laughs> Yesterday, PewDiePie made a video being like, that's it for now, or something like that. <laughs> Literally, just the next day, a new video, like. Um. Wait, uh, what am I doing? Twitch. I'm also doing this as an excuse to just not constantly be playing, like, Jump King all the time. Because it, it is mentally draining, playing Jump King all the time. And by the way, just in case anybody's curious what the 138 follower goal was, because I'm here, I might as well read it. Uh, give me blonde eyebrows, that's what it was. So, expect the next stream to me to have blonde eyebrows. Just does not, it will, it will definitely not match anymore with the aesthetic I'm going for right now, if you even call this an aesthetic. And then it's grey eyes after that. I'm more looking forward to the Sherry Arbor story, yeah. Or the Sherry Arbor cosplay. I think that's going to be fun. I'm crazy? I was crazy once. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Community analytics settings? Stream. Display a temporary visual to viewers for 90 seconds while you're to reconnect. Note this requires to use the major encoder to work properly. I thought it was, I thought it said 90 minutes. I'm like, bro, that's a long time. So it's 90 seconds. So you have a minute and a half to reconnect your stream or else it'll just disconnect you. Mature content. Uh... Yeah, I don't think I need to do that. It's mostly for a uh, thing anyway. When turned on, you'll be notified if multiple instances of copyright audio are detected in your VOD within 24 hours. Uh, and ability to publish VODs by default on the channel is proactively disabled by turning three that you understand it, including Andra. I write to any copyright notification or taking other actions against your channel. So that's why I have that as a thing anyway. Automatically save broadcast. For I s it's weird how that still says 14 days, but it's seven days now. And then for. Uh, partners, Turbo, and Prime user, it's all uh, 60 days. So basically, if I just got like uh, Twitch Prime or Amazon Prime, I'd be able to save them for uh, 60 days. Which I feel like is a bit excessive anyway, honestly. I don't really need all them VODs. Enable clips. <laughs> Only allow subscribers to make clips of your channel, damn. When able followers must follow you for a specific amount of time before they are allowed to make clips of your uh, nah, we won't do that. And exclude categories. Hmm. Nah, there's not there's no like reaction kind of thing, is there? Yeah. 
Uh, there is, but like, nah. A clip is not really a thing. Channels, people stream. Who can stream to your channel? <laughs> Let me just show everybody my uh, stream code real quick. And then add drops so enabled and all that. If I ever do a game. Actually, I'm kind of curious now. Is there any games that have drops right now? Because it has been a while since I've uh, streamed a uh, drop stream. Let's see. Don't know what that is. Honkai. I know Dead Island 2. Oh, that's the... Is that a Twitch game? It says Nitro Stream Racing. We won't touch Overwatch 2. Half of these I don't even know. Paladins, I remember. I Actually, this would be a great time to get into Paladins 1, actually. Paladins was kind of gas when I played it. That could be my new Overwatch, honestly. Just playing Paladins. Oh, yeah, Smite and fucking Iron Mouse is... Uh... Or the so V so V Shoujo's skins are like in the game or something like that. You just get viewer points off the drops. Tower of Fantasy, I feel like I've heard of. I actually I kinda wanna write up Paladin somewhere. Hold on. Oh And in a second I'm gonna go to Lou and I feel like I need to go. Week 4, Barbarian, so that's Diablo 4. I hear good stuff about it, I just haven't bothered to try and play it yet. I'll scroll online. Warframe. Maybe that'll be my Destiny replacement after Destiny is like, okay, you know what? I'm going to get into Warframe. Um, Paladins. Let me see. Oh, that's Honkai Impact 3rd. I only played it once. Probably never going to play it again because it feels weird to play on PC. Right, Grant. Okay, I'm going to go... I know I literally just took a break not too long ago, but I actually need to go to Lou, so... Oh, I hope. I really hope. Sorry, I just seen the thumbnail here. Like, Logan Paul got caught. It just says, Logan Paul hit with class action lawsuit over NFT game. I really hope that, like... Because I feel like he is capping when he says it was going to be a game and all that. I feel like he's trying to pull the wall over people's eyes. Honestly, like, there was a period of time that I actually did trust Logan again. I was like, I mean, people could change, we could do... And then he just pulls the shit with, like, the, the zoo game or whatever it was called, the NFT shit. And it's like, nah. Nah. It's <laughs> just, nah. Right, sorry. Anyway, BRB, I'm going to go to Lou. I've just played the clips ad again. Or what? Well, it's not an ad to Twitch. It's a it's a break. That's what it is, yes. Actually, I, okay, wait. I need to do this as well, actually, before I go. Because I need to actually... Because I'm doubling down on making sure I don't get banned, like, tomorrow morning. I need to get rid of um VODs that have, uh like, the Sherry Arbor story ads and stuff. I'm going to... Let me see. Am I actually low or am I just low in thing? Oh, because my headset's down, that's why. Okay, never mind. Because I was listening to myself there, I was like, damn, I sound a bit low, but I'm probably blasting people's ears out right now. Um, Yeah, video producer. Um, Oh, shit, I just realized, though, that will that not count for fucking clips as well? Ah, whatever. Just leave it, Joe. If you get, <laughs> just, just like if you get banned, you get banned. It is how it is. I just can't be arse, like. God, I'm sorry. Things keep distracting me now. Okay, there we go. Done. Right. Close that. Go, Lou. Here be. How convenient where it's just like, and no, I didn't have my mic muted. I swear, I swear. I'm sorry. Look, okay, look, at least I saw it immediately. I was like, oh yeah, I need to turn this on. Anyway. What are you doing, mate? What are you doing? Damn those cheeks, though! Damn! The physics! 
Three, two, one. It, it's happened. It, it, it's happened. We're finally here. I am now a maid. If you talk about the, um, whatchamacallit, the thingy charity calendar, I didn't actually buy it. And if he has an OnlyFans, I haven't bought it. Yet. But yeah. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, fine lab, I'll show you again. Look, look, right, pay attention. Exactly, right? Like, bro, I, I'm not even going to put that as a follower goal. I don't even want this anymore. I want to make sure to turn this shit off, like... Comes down here and messes with my day. Bro, we're fucking sheltered. Let's go. Oh my fucking god, that scared the fucking shit out of me! Sorry. Mm. Let's try not talk too much about America right now. Makes me miss, like, traveling already. But the traveling will happen again soon. The Ten Commandments! I'm sorry, I had to do it. Why do they moan so close to my ear? Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry to rip you away from that moment, but we have to get back into it. Uh, I feel like I at least have to go for another half an hour with Jump King, or else I haven't given it a proper attempt. Cause guys, I swear, I'm, I'm, I'm doing- oh, for fuck's sake. I was about to say I'm doing better and then I do that, like. Right, it was nice knowing you. Going back to the bottom of bog. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Maybe I could just throw this pen against the wall, but... Nah. How about I try and preserve the pen if I can? So I'm still kind of using it, like... I still use pen and paper. Like, you think after I left school I'd never use it again, but like, honestly, there's just some instances where I'm still using pen and paper. Even the whiteboard's not sufficient enough all the time. Which is kind of weird when you think about that now. The most amount of time I've ever used pen and paper, I think, is... Actually, no, at work I use a bit of pen and paper, never mind. But in, like, all my life, it's definitely school that I've used it a lot. Like, even now, I was actually writing recently. I was like, damn, how the fuck did I do this when I was younger? Like, this is so tiring, like... And I didn't even write that much as well. I only wrote, like... Um, whatchamacallit? Like, basically a paragraph if you just combine them all together, like... And my hand was fucking, like, tired after that. Maybe it's all this gaming. All this gamer stuff has weakened my hand. Oh my god. There we go. Just give me a second. Oh. Right, anyway. Uh, so yeah, tomorrow, <laughs> just tomorrow, streaming Jump King. Again, I probably should do that as a joke tomorrow. Just stream on the uh, kick and just see, like... It's just everybody that actually follows each other, like, wait, somebody's actually streaming in this category? What the fuck? It's like, yes, it is me. VTuber guy. I'm streaming in the Twitch or the kick category. Or the kick? The Jump King Kick category. There we go. There's a lot of K's in there. King. Jump King Kick category. Oh no, there's a, there's a C in there as well. There's stuff that sound the same in there. There we go, that's a better phrasing. Oh, I'm gonna hit the... Oh, I actually hate myself. This is why I shouldn't, like... Why am I here? Why am I still here? I should just go off. I should just call it quits right now whilst I have still some sanity left. To be honest, I actually am feeling kind of cooler right now, but that's only because like the window was open and the room isn't as warm, but it's starting to rain a bit, so I just was like, eh, might as well close the window. Oh, I'm going insane. 
I already live in Ireland. I don't need to be here any longer, like. Oh, thank you. Third mile go. Oh my god, really? Am I really that impatient that I can't get up this fucking slope, man? I think it's a, like, again, I can't really get pissed at the game because there's nothing the game is doing right now that's actually going to piss me off. It's me and my own fucking jumping that's annoying me. Like, the game has actually been surprisingly really fair with me as opposed to fucking map 2 where in Underberg the wind just blows and it can fuck you over so easily. At least then I can actually complain about it being an in-game thing. But with this, I can't complain at all. Like, there's nothing actually, like, that's actively pushing me in this right now. Okay, there we go. We're good. Nah, not much. Look, Joe, over is better than under. Especially right now, when you're just, like, trying so hard, but not getting too far. Because in the end, it just didn't even matter, like. Okay. I thought I was going to hit the thing, that's why I did the out. I guarantee I would have hit it. I would have hit the fucking thing above me. Okay. Up we go. Up we go. Over we go. Up we go. Oh, why do I keep doing that? Why am I so impatient? Like, even there, with the way I jump there, like, I'm being impatient, like, and I hate it so much. Like, again, I know what I'm doing wrong. It's just fixing what I'm doing wrong. That's all it is. Like, this should just be this now. Just nice little jumps until we reach this side. This until we reach here. That until we reach there. Are you fucking kidding me? Even then, when I was trying to give an example, I was doing the, like the opposite of the example that I wanted to show. I'm gonna hit the oak. Now you might hit the wall. Yeah. We need to do that, do this, gonna hit the oak. You're not gonna make this next jump. You're gonna jump over this. You're gonna miss this jump. You're gonna not stick to this. You're not gonna stick to the next one. You're gonna overshoot this. You're gonna overshoot that. I lied, I undershot it. You're gonna miss this jump. You're not going to stick the landing on this one, Chief. You're not going to stick the landing on this one, Chief. You're going to overshoot this one. I was actually not in a bad position there. If anything, I should just shut the fuck up, like... Oh my god. Such a simple jump, man. I've done... I've, I think this is why I'm being driven insane right now. It's the same section I've done so many times. And I still can't do it efficiently. Like, like the efficiency of me is just worn off. Like, I had efficiency 4, but now I'm just stuck on, like, no efficiency at all. Oh, uh, I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna cry. At least I can turn the background music up a little bit, or this ambience. Bounce. Good man yourself. Nah, jump over. You're gonna miss that. You're gonna over jump that. Over jump this. You're not gonna make the next one. You're gonna hit the oak. You're not gonna jump right to the edge where you need to be. I told you. I don't cap. 
Some of this you're not wearing anymore. I'm wearing the crown. You're gonna bounce off this one. You're gonna slip off because of that. You're not gonna reach where you wanna be. I kind of didn't cap there. You're gonna miss this one. You're gonna go over the edge. You're not gonna stick the landing. You're not gonna be able to wall bounce from there. You're not gonna hit get this. <laughs> so I'm running out of excuses to fucking pray on my own downfall, like. Just, I'm happy enough with that. We just end stream here now, whilst I'm actually, like, winning. I guess that's why half these streams end depressingly, because, like, I don't, like, I don't achieve a victory at the end. I usually end it on a bad note, like, there's never a time I'll make more, like, progress and be like, you know what, I'm gonna stop here before I fall. It's always just like, yeah, I'm gonna keep going until I fall, like. <laughs> And I imagine with this being the last map, they probably not have a checkpoint in this one. They probably don't have a checkpoint in this one. So it's probably going to be even rougher, like, when I actually make a lot of progress and I just fucking slip all the way down, like, literally all the way back down into bog, like, no bother. Because at least on the other maps, there was, like, the halfway section of the map where they'd actually... Basically, it's almost impossible to fall down to unless you really are bad at the game, like like myself. I mean, even as someone as bad as me playing this, like, if I'm bad and I can make progress, then you can too. Like. Yeah, you can make the right choice today by doing bleep. Joey, can't say that now, it's an audio ad. Is it no wonder Kick now has like 10 million accounts? I don't even doubt people though as well for like moving to Kick, especially if it like if they need money, like you're gonna move, like you're gonna take that risk. And eventually, like Kick is only gonna keep growing, like with different features and whatnot as well, like so. I'm doing a mistake right now by not streaming on like more on Kick, honestly. It's just like TikTok, I didn't really like get onto it until after it was already popular, you know? I don't know. But as I mentioned before, the Cloud Goblin's kind of a dastardly little fella. You don't want to run in with the Cloud Goblin. That's a bad person, bro. Could ruin your life if you're not careful. Isn't it weird to think about that there's somebody that probably made a YouTube account back in like 2005 or something and they're still making content to this day but they haven't been recognized yet? Like that's actually kind of a sad thing, isn't it? Because I only thought of that there because I've been going now for like, oh basically ten and a half years now. And I could keep going and YouTube could still never become my full time job. That's alright. I'm trying to find other avenues in life as well that give me fulfillment. Not that it's immediate that I need them, but... Yeah. Something will happen. Either I'll find something good or I'll die before it happens. Saying it randomly in a lot of the context. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I didn't even mention as well, I forgot to mention this at all, but like there's actually a new um I think I removed two sounds and I added two new sounds or something like that. Um and it's like a custom one as well. 
as I said, I was re-watching all their videos. I was like, oh, I'm gonna take this one. I'm gonna make a sound by it, like. I definitely, at some point, I need to soundbite myself saying, Let's go! And maybe use that as, like, the fucking follower goal, uh, follower goal sound alert. I think my mental, like, pressure has just built up too much. Oh my god. But again, my eyes are just not used to this now. <sighs> Shit. You just gotta be not scared of it, really. That's the whole thing. Like, stop doubting yourself, stop being scared. You're not over-calculating, you're not under-calculating. Just do. I say that as I did that, but still. So. Shush. mentioned this as well because I see in Logan Paul there about the fame thumbnail. But um, him and KSI went to a new place to release Prime. And apparently the story was that like people were just throwing bottles at them and all that and I even seen comments of people falling for it and stuff. But apparently like Logan made like a fucking like TikTok or a short or something like that talking about it. And apparently that was planned. And he even showed proof as well so it's not like he was just pulling out of his ass. But like, he was like, oh yeah, it was KSI's idea and stuff. So I feel like if he said it was it was his idea, then everybody would actually berate him. Like, he's like, ah, oh, pulling the wool over eyes again. How Logan Paul, like. I say this now, but if I ever met him in person, I'd be fucking, I'd be scared shitless. Like, fellas, what? I think he's like six foot something, honestly. I'm literally like a chihuahua barking up the wrong tree, like, or at the wrong dog. But, I mean, it did work though as a social marketing, or a social media marketing ploy. Where, like, you make the media think one thing, but the other thing actually happens. But yeah, even so, like, I'm still not gonna be getting prime. Like, maybe if they did a reveal event in Ireland, I'll think about it, but, like, honestly, I don't know. I'd probably still be there, and I'd probably still have a fun time, like, being there, regardless, but, yeah. I'd also be scared, though, that I'd be there just to record stuff as well. As I said, though, I try not to let the little cloak up and take over. Having the bad case of a cloak up is like having cancer, in a sense. It's just a bad thing overall, like. There's never been a time the Clout Goblin has been used in a positive sense, like. And I feel like I'm overusing that term now, but it is truly, like, what I think it is, honestly. Just, you act abnormal for the sake of online clout or popularity. I probably couldn't live with myself properly if I fucking to come to the clout goblin or fully succumbed should I say depending on the incident as well like or what I'm recording because the thing is right every time like there's TikToks of people doing shit and all that like of um doing something that just you know, obviously it's to garner attention. I'd never be able to do that. I'm not confident enough in that sort of shit to see that sort of stuff through. I'm kind of glad I'm an introvert in that way. Because if I was an extrovert, I probably would let the Cloud Goblin do more. But I just choose not to let him. But anyway, Jump King time. Today we'll be playing... Today we'll be playing Jump King while trying to stay as quiet as physically possible. Oh. 
Oh, I said as quiet as possible, Joe. Try again. I wonder if, like, the developers of the game ever just stalk people on Twitch as they play the game. Even to this day, just to see what they're up to. See who's suffering today. She thought we were gone, that's why I fucking gave up there for a minute and just let myself slide. Okay, then yeah, no, we're done. You literally had the chance of a comeback and then- Like, even now, you have a second comeback chance. That's a fucking rarity, but you're still gonna fuck it up, like. See, you were almost gonna fuck it up just there, like. I swear down. This man. Okay. Good job, Joe. Good job, G-G. G G G G I wonder like if I didn't have everything like ticked off the 18 plus and the sexual themes and the fucking vulgar themes, if I didn't have them ticked, does that mean like Twitch just have more of an excuse to get rid of me? I mean you'd have to be a real hard ass to actually enforce that shit really heavily. Unless there was a particular reason for it, like... God. I know, like, the copper wall was introduced, like, probably in 2018-19 time, but I still hope I never hit again with another... This video's been deemed made for kids, because it's such a sh Like, it honestly, it's just... It's bad. So I think like once it's like actually deemed as made for kids, your video ends up on like um YouTube Kids app, I think, like or something like that. That's why I'm always like, nope, that my content not for kids, definitely not. And if that ever happened with a video, I would literally change the description just so it says like fuck cunt shit and all that, and then fucking reapply saying eh, no, it's not made for kids, and then you should like, oh yeah, it's not. Why do we mark this as thing? Because then if they approve that as made for kids and has swear words and it's like, hmm, YouTube, what are you up to? And the foot, the worst part is, I wouldn't even be able to re-upload that video. Because once a video has been, like, scanned or deemed as this thing or the other, like, it stays as that. Like, I was actually looking at, um, videos on the archive channel as well. And, like, I realized that there as well, it's like, oh yeah, this fucking... Like, honey pop video, like, regardless if I re-upload this in a even low, like, even a, like, a tad bit lower quality than it was before, because it's re-upload, they'll still mark it as 18 plus, because, like, the system already has a copy of it, probably even clearer copy of it, and it's like, oh, yep, that video shouldn't be allowed on the platform, if it's not marked as 18 plus. But yeah, hopefully it just never comes to that. But to be fair, I don't really do anything that, like, would warrant that. Unless I started playing with Legos or something, like. That sounds like a shout of a stream idea, though. Literally just building with Lego stream. Dun, 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 dun. I didn't even mention this before, but like, the game we're going to be playing in November is going to be Genetsu no Yohane. I can't remember the game title, but like, it's a, um, it's a game we're going to be playing. It's going to be the best 40 I've ever spent. It's literally just a side-scroller game, but I just have to play it, like. 
I already have it on my wish list and I'm ready for it. I was surprised though, because in that franchise, like the Love Live franchise, they don't. Oh, for fuck's sake. They don't really do, um. I don't think they've ever done, like, an Xbox port of the game before. And technically, that is their first time. Not even just being on, like, mobile and PSP and all that, but also, like, just being on everything at once. Which is really surprising. It's on PC, Steam. I say Steam, but I think it's Steam and Epic. Um, Xbox, both Xboxes, both Playstations, the Switch and all that as well. I wouldn't be surprised if there's like a mobile port of it as well, because it's just... It's a simple pixelated kind of game, so like, it won't be too hard for thing. Now I say that, but I'm not a game developer, so I wouldn't know. I have actually thought about it recently though, I might, like, I have downloaded Source Filmmaker, the thing um, that Valve made ages ago for making your own uh, cutscenes and stuff in like Valve-like games and whatnot. I kind of want to see if I can use that as a posing software for like uh, making thumbnails. So I feel like if they allow like VTuber models to be imported into it then like it's a no-brainer, you know? Just use that software and just use it as a modeling software. Oh, hi, Ghost. I don't know what you were there for a minute. I'd forgotten everything about the game because I've just been doing this same section over and over and listening to the same music over and over and then getting back to the fly section over and over and missing that jump, like, sometimes. Which is a pain. Can we actually just question, though, what even is the black ice stuff? Like, is it actually just black ice or is it actually fly gunk? That's why I imagine it being just fucking broken down fly gunk. Look, it doesn't matter. You're gonna go back down to thing anyway. Just do it, like. I just hope when that game releases, though, that they don't actually have copyright music in it. Because if they do, then it's like, oh well, shit, then I guess I won't play on stream. Or I'll play it muted on stream or something like that. So I'm definitely not going to be playing it without the music. I'd have to play it with the music, though. It's funny how, like, an, like basically an April Fool's joke has turned into... Well, I think it was it, like as a comic form in their magazine, and then they've turned it into an April Fool's joke, and then they turned it into an actual anime. And then the game itself was also an April Fool's joke, but they also turned it into like an actual thing as well. Basically, any time they make something that's April Fool's, it's almost like a release trailer for something like... I like it, though. <sighs> okay, we're back up here. If you drop down... Oh, I actually have to slam the keyboard. The rage is just internalizing and it's just annoying me now. You know, I'm just gonna fucking turn down my headset in advance, just so I don't have to listen to thing music, like... The most I want to listen to is myself jumping, like... I can hear that no matter what, like, volume I'm at, because I think my brain just fills in the sound that I can't hear anyway. Dun 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 It's kind of funny now I think about it. Like any time these like different changes happen to platforms to be more advertiser friendly and appeal more to kids and stuff it's like they'll say they're not trying to but they are at the same time because go shocker kids have the most time on the internet i say that but i spend a lot of time myself on the internet but like endlessly what is that phrase about the fish um Shit. Okay, there we go. 
that's better. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. No, it's not fish a man to fish. No, teach a man to fish. No, teach a man... No, it is, isn't it? It's like teach... Wait, what was the phrase? I can't remember. Fish... I can't remember. I genuinely can't remember the phrase. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, that's not as bad as I thought it was. But this is going to be even worse once I fall down the other side. Some about fishing, anyway. That's the phrase I was on about. Teach a man to fish or something, and he has, like, food for life or something like that. Or, yeah, feed a man a fish. And he is, like, he's fed for a day, but... Uh, feed, or teach a man to fish. And he's fed for life or some shit like that. It's not the exact wording, obviously. I can't remember the exact wording, but... Similar enough. Some about that now, but with tablets and kids, it's like... Give a kid your phone and distract them for an hour, but give a kid a tablet and distract them infinitely. <laughs> distract them for a few years. There you go, actually. That's the modification we make to that now. Yeah, no, I really do hope, though, if I ever do have kids myself, that I'm a decent father. I don't want to be like, um every other parent and just give them a tablet because I feel like that's just a lazy way of parenting like and like especially because I know that there's weird shit on the internet as well like you definitely have to put safeguards in place before just allowing them unlimited access to the fucking internet like I don't know but as I keep saying before first I need to find a partner which that task isn't easy because I just. Well, it's not even that. I'm, I'm just lazing and using fucking dating apps, honestly. And as a viewer said before, it's probably better experience that you just don't use a dating app, like. I definitely wouldn't want to fall down the rabbit hole of just paying for stuff in a dating app, honestly. It feels like the most waste of money you can spend your thing on. Oh, hi, ghost. Like, why spend money in an app to date someone when you could just play, like, you know, Junk King for, like, 20 quid and, you know, like, hang out with tree babes that actually take effort to get to. But you will get to eventually because, you know, you're persistent in the game. And you'll reach there eventually. Okay, I'm gonna... Apparently throw! But anyway, I was gonna say I was gonna turn up my headset a little bit, but... <sighs> Falling all the way back down here. I'm actually gonna cry. Yeah, this ain't this shit ain't funny anymore. I'm just gonna cry at this point. <laughs> what was that meme about something on the shirt? It's just like um It's not like don't bully me, I'll come. It's like don't choke me, I'll come or some shit like that. Something like that. The shirt you would never see me wear. IRL anyway. <laughs> I can't mark my VTuber model well, but that's different. I mean, I'm already wearing a maid dress, and I actually remember the hairband today, so... I, I actually am at this point now where I'm just sick of this. I just want to do something else, like... Especially when I'm... Why am I doing that? Like, I don't understand. What do I gain from that? Like, in all seriousness, though, what the fuck do I gain from that? From fucking throwing. Like, my shit all the time. What do I gain from this? Dun dun dun. dun 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 You can tell I've just given up because I haven't... <laughs> just... Oh, I wanna scream. I wanna fucking scream, man. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not arsed with this. I had to change my mind. I think I already had one today, so I'm not gonna have another one. And of course you could say, oh, what's wrong with that? Nah. There's a lot wrong with that. 
if I allowed myself to just eat any amount of the food that's in the house, I would actually start to gain significant weight. We would be buying so much food. It's ridiculous. I would probably get called out by my parents and be like, you know, why don't you just buy your own food from now on? Please, Joe, just fucking... If you're gonna jump off the edge, just do it. Please. Thank you. That was a good new method, and you fucked it over. Might be nearly time to take a break from Jump Gang. I can't lie. I think I'm reaching that point now where I actually need to give Jump King a break before coming back to it and play other games again. I need a mental refresh. How huh, funny you might say that, Joe. Jeez. Oh. That's a hiccup, isn't it? Half? Oh, I swear if these hiccups fuck me over, I'm actually... Yeah, the Hatsune Miku cover should be like coming around. I, actually, no, should I even say a day? Because then it's almost like a promise. Oh, for fuck's sake. It'll be out when it's out. Sometime July, give or take. I like 
watched a video recently actually about um, the term that TikTok was using, probably not too long ago, I don't really know, but it was talked about like something about quiet quitting, I think it was called, where it's like, you kind of just like, um, it's basically when you're doing your job, but doing exactly what your job entails. Oh, for fuck's sake. So essentially, if that if I apply that to my job, like, damn, I, I would not be doing anything. I would be bored as fucking shit, like. Like, even though my job is one thing, like the job description says one thing, it's kind of an accum accumulation of a bunch of things. So if I were to only do that one thing, the one thing I was actually asked to do in the, like, um interview in the job post like I would be bored shitless I would already have left my workplace ages ago like well not really actually I would still be doing it but I would want to leave it ages ago and probably already be in the process of leaving it but I guess like I understand where quiet quitters are coming from where it's like some people just kind of want to do a job and they don't want to be doing it for like years on end they kind of want to just keep job hopping and go from job to job I think that would even help if you had like a network of people and friends that also wanted to do the same as you. So let's say like, you know, uh, let's say I had a friend that does exactly what I do, but like they're starting to get sick of their job. I'm like, oh, why don't you just try my one out? I'll quit mine and I'll try and sign up for yours and we'll swap places essentially. Of course, that'd be in the benefit of both companies and all for fuck's sake. It'd be in the benefit of both companies as well, but you know, it'd also give like a bit of a guarantee to that other person, be like, hey, whoa, look at that, uh, yeah, we could just swap jobs, see what's like. Actually, it wouldn't even be similar jobs you'd be swapping, actually, it'd be more of, like, different jobs. So I think that's the whole point of quiet quitting as well, it's like, you're not just quitting your current job, you're also going to find, like, another new job that's, like, different and stimulates you in a different way. Which, again, I don't even doubt. I think our attention spans have been fucking shot to shit, so, like, of course you want to do something new after, like, not even a year, I'd say. Probably, like, even nine months, like. Because even now, I've already talked about how I kind of want to, like, double dip in working and stuff, and how I'd probably, like, by halfway mark of my job, I'd already want to be looking for a nerd place. But to be fair, I do only work part-time right now, so, like... I should be looking for more full-time work, because technically I can keep doing my current part-time job, but it is to help me get into, like, full-time work, you know? And I feel like six months is a nice, like, number to, like, leave at, because, like, that's half a year's experience doing what you do at your job, you know? But at the same time, it doesn't mean I'm instantly just gonna say one day, alright guys, sorry, I'm gonna bounce now, have fun, you know? Even though that I, that actually might be part of one of my very multiple different plans that I have in my head. Where it's like, instead of just getting a job straight away, I just like, quit my current place. Take like a month out and try and get another place. And then one of the other plans is the extreme opposite, where it's like, no, you have to try and get like another place, start working part time in that other place, and then eventually like blend in uh, your new job and your old job and swap places with them and then eventually get full time in your part time job and go from there. I don't know. I do know though if I like whenever I do leave my current job because I feel like it's going to be inevitable that it does happen in the next like I'd say in the next like year or two. Oh shit. Um, it will happen in the next year or two where I'm going to leave my current workplace for another workplace. When it does happen though, it's going to be sad. I, I just know like it's going to be a sad time. Because even when uh, somebody in our workplace was working for a while now and they actually left recently, um, we kind of like, uh, like had a thing ready for them when they were going to leave, so... My workplace won't let me out without a few um, tear-jerking moments, you know? But I do know as well, if I did leave my current workplace, like, even if I were to reapply there in the future, they would let me back in, like, if I really needed it.
Nah, too little. Oh my god, after all that time and progress, just flush down the drain because my brain cells can't comprehend how to jump. It's baffling, it's actually baffling. It's so cringe. Yeah, I guess that's like my plan for life in a sense, actually, now that I think about that. It's literally just job hopping, like, for the rest of my life. And then obviously I'll try and do YouTube and Twitch and stuff on the side, and if that ever takes off, I'll give it a chance. But if it doesn't, then it doesn't. Oh, for fuck's sake. I know when I jump like that, I fall down to bog, but I still did it anyway, like... That's annoying. If anything, I feel like if I do look back on this era in the future, this is going to be my uh, VTuber era. So I do feel like sometime in the future, maybe I will just go face the camera for once. And not with a mask on or a VTuber model covering me. That'd be an interesting time if that ever happens. I only imagine that happening though in like, the worst case scenario. Where it's like somebody doxes everything about me, like my name, my address, and all that sort of shit, like. And then my face as well, and I'm like, well, fuck, I guess I'm gonna just not uh, be this anymore. I guess I'm gonna show my face. At least once. And then move on, maybe, with being a VTuber more. Because I feel like, um. Won't be able to, like, really fulfill my, uh, customization role anymore if I couldn't, uh you think. But then again, even IRL, you can kind of do the same thing I'm doing. You just need a lot of props and uh, get creative with it, you know? Any streamer could technically do what I'm doing as a customizable VTuber. They could be a customizable flesh tuber instead. Oh, shit. Okay, can I actually make it up here? That'd be a funny little tie-in. I was <laughs> just like... Oh, uh, now I'm a VTuber. Now I'm a flesh tuber. Now I'm both at the same time. I, ju I just remember Kason's um, genius one though, where she merged like her uh, VTuber model with her IRL. So she just had like her head in, like the shot, like her VTuber head. But then like she just had like because she was wearing cosplay, I think of herself. She just had her boobs in the fucking like lower half of the screen, like. like this music, because I've definitely gotten sick of it. Up we go. What are you doing? To think I wear this crown and I can't even complete map tree. Hi ghost, hi ghost. Oh my god! You actually did it, like, no way. You're gonna fail up here. That's the rule of thumb. You're gonna fall to bog. It's gonna happen. There should be an achievement for visiting bog so many times. You have to be not absolutely joking me because I did it. Let's go. Why? I can't even do that with my hands because it would hurt. Oh my god, okay. I know the way I call myself stupid all the time, but then I have to remember that there's other people who are a lot more stupider than I am. Sometimes I forget about that fact. And I just need to reaffirm that to myself. I'm like, damn, at least I'm not this like stupid, you know? So I will touch on it briefly, that somebody did like, um, like an apology video, but like, they used a ukulele? And they weren't really sorry? 
I think that's the worst thing you can do when making an... Well, I, I mean, they didn't title their video Apology Video, but if you're trying to bring it up in an essence like an Apology Video, it's best not to piss off the people that are pissed at you. <laughs> I don't know. I guess, like, you're feeling a different bunch of emotions when you're doing it, so... Especially with how serious the ones were as well, like, you kind of, like, do feel a bit, like, you know, crazy. Like, I was crazy once. Like, they put me in a rubber room. A rubber room with rubber wraps. I said that all wrong. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me... Wait, so, crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A room? A room with wraps. No, a room, a rubber room. A rubber room full of rats. A rubber room full of rubber rats. Nah, that's not even right either, is it? I feel like that's wrong. It's the probably closest we'll get for today anyway. Especially whilst my brain is working at lower capacity. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, there's some like work I had to do as well at home. I couldn't do it at my work. Well, I can technically do it at my workplace, but it was better to just do it now at home whilst, like, I was here and I have it on me. But yeah, I feel like it's going to be more common occurrence now. I'm going to get it for the next few weeks or so. still things with mates I still want to do. I really should reach out to them to do it. Like, even just for the raid thing, just, like, um, do a Destiny raid together. Just for the fun of that. I would love to try and get back into Deepstone Crypt and, like, farming that for, uh, like, eyes of tomorrow. And then make my way from there, because I think I have every other raid exotic before then. Because I definitely have Last Wishes. Even though I talk about so much about hating Destiny, I still like it. It really is that meme moment of just like, oh yeah, Destiny 2, I hate it, it's my favourite game. Oh. Honestly, I do, like, I wish Destiny was more like, uh... Um, like, somehow just had the same kind of mindset as, like, Genjin. It's like, you literally just get all the content for free, and the only thing you really have to pay for is just the fucking gacha, like. But obviously, Destiny's not going to reintroduce loot boxes, but, like, I mean, Eververse must make them a shit ton already, like. But no, apparently it's not enough to just make, um... DLCs, battle passes, seasons, and microtransactions. We also got to add in uh, dungeon keys. We also got to add in uh, what else was there? The fucking battle pass within a battle pass, as Asmund Gold called it, which is actually kind of true. I think I even memed on that before myself by saying that myself. But... Oh, hi, ghost and bye, ghost. I think it's more I bitch about Destiny, the more I'm gonna fall here, so I should probably stop doing that. Oh! I'm so tired. I'm actually just ridiculously tired. I had a full can of monster this morning. Not even a full can of monster can get me through the day anymore. It's hopeless. We ain't made, making pro I say that now, we ain't making progress during the stream, but I have to get into the five, six hour range before I actually start making progress, like. Which is sad in upon itself that I have to, like, spend that amount of time in game before actually making progress, like. Like, I've been close to making more progress, but we're not going to reach that height again in this stream. That thing I can guarantee. Dun dun. battlefield. Please remain in the battlefield. Thank you for remaining in the battlefield. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm 
sorry, I'm just thinking about the fucking whole dating app debate I already talked about today. I feel like I am at that age though, where like, my brain is only panicking more about it because of the whole fact that like, I think it was like back in like the stone ages or something, like people only lived to like 30. So it's just like, me being a 23 year old, that's me like in the like, essentially the late second half of my life. 15 is where I meant to have peaked and honestly I can kind of agree with that. I don't know why, but I remember, like, 2015 just being a good year for me or something like that. Maybe 2015 was when the big changes started happening to me. Even though when I look back on the content, it's just as bad, like, as 2014, like. There we go. Because at, the, at, the, yeah, at that same time... As I said, 23 is like the late half of life when you're like living in the stone age. When you're 30, like you're meant to have already been dead, like. We've advanced so much as a fucking species, like, that we go beyond that. We can live triple that. Essentially. At most, like, double. Why? It's the same jump every time. I'm just... Crazy, I was crazy once. They locked me in a room, a rubber room, a rubber room full of rats, a rubber room full of rubber rats. If, if YouTube comments were actually funny, they would be posted. Or spam. Actually, no, I say that now, but if they do start doing that, I would actually get pissed off. Like. It's like I'm trying to go back down to Bog. Joe. Pop on. Will ya? Curve Mahavo. I really should stop speaking different languages during my stream, like. Because nobody's gonna understand all of them. Like, when I say Donka, that's like, thank you in Danish, I think. Or is that German? It might be German. And then, like, or if Mahaga is like, thank you in Irish. Oh, to make Fargurum is I am angry in Irish. If only if they taught the language right, I'd actually be more prouder to say, like, say stuff in it. People really be <laughs> just going to start studying Irish so they can get away with saying certain things in Irish that they couldn't say in English, like. Because who's going to call them out for it? Like, the two people that speak Irish, like. Neil may geisha or scale get a little hot. Tommy coin toss barely so Tommy geisha. Yeah, I couldn't even finish what I was trying to say in Irish. Like, at least I tried. Oh my god! You know, believe it or not, that was an act of mercy. That is also an act of mercy. You know what's not an act of mercy? Having me st stuck in this same loop, giving me hope every single time that maybe this is the uh, like one. This is where I'm actually gonna make it out. You know? That's not an act of mercy. That's just an act of cruelty. This game has violated human rights codes, left, right, and center. For fuck's sake, it's the same. It's the same. It's the same. Have I ever tell, told you what the definition of insanity is? It's doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a different fucking result, like going down to bog and then missing the jump and then falling all the way to the bottom of bog and then spending another 10 minutes in bog, like... You know. I really should just put the Joker makeup on at this point. I 
I don't even remember map 2 doing this much to my, like, sanity. But again, I think all that, like, is all this, like, one of the same memory. That's why, like, it all just faded out at once. Yeah, Cole, your wife. Yeah, I know. You have a happy life. Go fuck yourself. That's why my nose is like this sometimes. Hmm. Interesting thought process, Jeff. You're probably going to forget about it in two seconds, but you know. As I said before. I'm ready to try, to try and not take these streams for granted if I can. Because one day it's probably going to be my final time streaming and I'm not going to be able to stream again for a while. Who knows, I might just die tomorrow and then I just like, well, that was my final stream, have fun. You know, actually that is a morbid thought that like, your favorite YouTuber who just doesn't upload anymore probably just died and you just don't know of it. Because they weren't big enough to have more connections to tell you that. So if I ever do stop uploading content, it's probably because of that. Because usually I would mention why, like, I'd be stopping uploading for a bit, like... If I'm not active on Discord or Twitter or something like that, then, like... Yeah, just, just, just assume I'm dead. Just move on. You didn't miss much anyway when I was around. I'm not gonna lie though, when I talked about the phone and buying a new computer, the other alternative is literally buying a console. I have kinda thought about buying a PS4, but at the same time it's just like, as my mate said, you might as well just buy the PS5 at that point. Or even just buy a Switch, because I can guarantee then at that point that I would be playing something. Such a cringe nay nay mofo. Oh my god, I thought I could make it, man. I never know which way to go out from there, honestly. All I know is that I'm gonna be slamming my head into the desk in a minute. Maybe if I slam my head against the desk, I'll eventually, like ruin my brain so much that I just become a super genius or something like that. Who knows? Let's, uh, let's give it a shot. Nah, I'm joking. That was just my hand. I didn't actually slap my head. Because, you, you, I mean, you saw the model. Like, the model didn't move. Like, oh, hi, ghost. Oh. My brother in arms. Another thing I also need to do more is also just collabs in general, honestly. Like, I actually genuinely do need to do more uh, collabs with people. Because I've seen, like, even... It was, I think it was, like, Evan Ito's video, and he was just doing, like, a video of a bunch of people. And it just got me thinking. I was like, damn. I should be doing more of that. Just, like, chilling with people and just shooting the shit, like, for streams and whatnot. Because after a while, there is only so much I can do by myself as a content creator, like... And I do remember the glory days of uh, streaming with Panda and whatnot. Those were gas, those were fun. Those were opened a few moments as well. 
that's it. I need to get back to- man, there's so many different series I have going on that I'm just never gonna really go back to, is there? It's like, I have the Minecraft series I need to go back to, the Terraria series, the Community Terraria series. Actually, I think that's it. Oh, you know, the Captain. That's another game we need to go back to. Why does this always happen? Every time I see him, I think at the start, oh yeah, he's not actually that bad of a guy, but by the end, I'm just thinking, man, he was such a dickhead. He wouldn't just shut up about his fucking wife, like. Imagine actually having a significant other, like, that's just cringe. You know, try to solo life, solo flawless it? Like, bro, that's cringe. Imagine needing help in life. There are some moments that I put on, like, where I do just laugh at things that they're not meant to be laughed at. Like, we were watching, I think it was, a, I think it was called Supernatural or something. Uh, I was with my mates, and, like, we were just watching, like, the first episode, and it was just a woman burning on the ceiling by a ghost or some shit. And I'm just there, like, laughing at it, like, on purpose. I guess just as a kind of just... I don't know, I just did it, like... I think I did it once before as well, where I was like, oh yeah, it was in the cinema, where I was just like, experiencing like the 4D seats for the first time, and I was just laughing like a maniac. But to be fair though, that had actual merit, that had a reason. Because it's like, bro, this shit is so cool, how have I not seen this before? And even there, I just like, laughed a little bit, but like, I stopped myself, but like, I was actually genuinely gonna go on a Joker arc, like right there. Better be blood or else. Okay, it's not even blood coming from my nose that distracted me. Improve your fucking self. Cause then you really have to go. You've been the only thing that's right in all I've done. I know you're counting really near of how much I fucked up. But just remember this alright. I've got your IP. It's 2 for 5.286. 93.5282.296 and 3. Have fun, bro. See, the problem is, like, once I get to this level of just annoyance, I just can't get back in the mood. And then even at the start of the stream, I was fucked up because, like, I haven't played in a bit. And now I'm just getting too frustrated. I'm letting the game get to me too much. But that's the whole point. What What is the game if I'm not emotionally invested in it? I literally have cold so My diet is actually kind of well, not even rapidly changing, because then I'd be going against my own word about changing what I eat. So I've said before that like when you're going on a diet and stuff, it's probably best to phase out the food rather than completely cut them out. Oh, my ghost. 
I swear most of the time I'm actually eating bread now, which is probably a bad thing. Shouldn't be eating so much bread. But just can't be helped, man. Well, not even just bread, but bakery kind of things. It's like bread, the scones, toast sandwich sometimes. A uh, bacon sandwich with crisps. It really has become a bet like bread centric diet at the moment. We've got our mixtures of meat and stuff and whatnot and whatever is contained in coleslaw. Oh! You know, honestly, that was the best drop down to bog I've ever fucking seen in my life. I have never been so much more happier to be down here. I could literally just reset the time right now. But then I'd have to go through Buck again. <laughs> it's just like not worth it at all. Buck, excuse me. Sorry, boss, she's not here. <sighs> I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I'm literally just... Leave the keyboard alone, Joe. Leave, leave the keyboard alone. Don't say you'll never break the keyboard and then break the keyboard. Or don't think you'll never break the keyboard. So I don't think I've said that until then. But now that I've said it, yeah, I could break the keyboard. Could never break the. I could never do such a thing. I would never break an item in my room. You know sometimes you just get that destructive urge when you're raging at a fucking game where you're jumping as a knight, you know? See, I could jump more efficiently there, but that would require actually being good at the game. I'm not gonna lie to you. And unfortunately, I'm just not good at the game. So, we're gonna just leave it at that, honestly. Now, what I will say is, uh, tear droplets are constantly forming, like, in my eyes, or about to form. It's so, like, at any moment, I could just break down and cry. It might just happen. Might just have a VTuber moment on our hands. You just realize now that you're good at the game, right? Use that new confidence wisely. <laughs> I say that and I do that like. It's gonna hit the yoke. I mean you hit a yoke, that counts. Hey! A yoke! I'm sorry, I love my old videos, man. The uh, not the really old ones, but the ones like in the like I'd say in the time period of like 2019 to 2022. Actually, I'll even count 2023. Some of them aren't too bad. Like, maybe not even 2019. Maybe like the 2020s, we'll just say. Like, especially the bad rap era of videos. Those were just, oh, so good. That's what I mean as well by collabing with stuff as well. Because, like, when I was on YouTube, like, collabing was just a great thing. Because then, like, it was more fun to fucking edit something. Because it wasn't just me doing my own thing. I could actually edit other people doing other shit as well. And I could have, fu like, fun and fuck around with the footage as well, like... So, like, when, um, Jacob did something stupid, he's like... Um... I think... Oh, no, I, th I think he said before, like, in a video... To oh, no, he was fucking mocking one of us, being like, Yeah, I'm stupid. 
And then I just put in the subtitles, yes, we know you are. <laughs> it's just like, I love doing that. I love fucking around and editing, like. That's the best thing about being an editor. You have full control over how somebody looks like. You could, like, completely just make them look like God sent them down from Earth. Or you can make them just look like the worst person possible. And I tend to probably do the latter. Where I'm just like the worst person. Oh shit. Okay, can I actually make this jump? And obviously, with. Oh, for fuck's sake. And obviously, to add on to the collapse thing, it would be cool again. I keep mentioning this over and over again. To even just have somebody on for another episode of the Night Flyer podcast. Even if we weren't here in person, like, I could guarantee that they would get a recording of their voice, that'd be nice. Then I could just ask them to send their voice on over later or something like that and go from there. Even though, like, every episode of the Nightflyer podcast has taken place in person. And the funniest thing is, I could actually do, like, a, um, a camera one now of that because of my new up well, I say new upload speeds, but my current upload speeds. Because back then, my upload speeds weren't good. That's why they're all just images, like... And I kind of kept to the same tradition of, uh, I think I did anyway. Like, even in the last, like, Nightflyer uh, podcast episode where it's just an image because, like, that's how older episodes were. Just an image. You didn't even try. Like, at least if you tried, I actually would give you a bit of the benefit of the doubt, right? But you didn't even try. You were just like, yeah, I'm done. I'm mentally checking out from this. Well, Joe, how about we actually try, right? And that doesn't involve going that way. It involves going back upwards, Joe, not down. Okay, let me just check the fucking podcast real quick. I don't even know if all the episodes are... Are they? They actually might all be on the... um, Whatchamacallit, the Joseph Nightflyer channel. I can't remember. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. <laughs> no, I can't show that. I can't show that. It's just my... Um, what was the fucking... Uh, I don't even remember. Oh, the Night Fire podcast. The Night Fire podcast. I wonder if it actually... Oh, yeah, it does come up. Even when I mistype it. Uh, that's highlights. Where's the actual playlist? I like the way, like, some of them are... I don't know if I left the chapters in, but they're just divided into chapters. Playlist. That's not how you spell playlist, Joe, but we'll go with it. Play. There you go. <laughs> playlist. Um, yeah, no, it's only the highlights that are available there. But, I mean, on the channel, if I just go to my channel, it should be linked there as an actual thing. Yeah, podcasts. Not that I'd want to. Well, actually, I could make more than one, technically, but I don't know. If I did make a podcast with another person, it would have to be, like, a limited time run. It wouldn't be, like, a full-time one. I could never, like, commit to uploading a new podcast episode every single week for, like, an unknown period of time. It would ha definitely have to be a limited time kind of thing. Let's see, full podcast. I know it does has all the episodes and they're all on the one channel. I'm surprised they're not segmented and scattered on all the other channels, like. But to be fair, it's only the Joe Snyder channel or the archives it could be on. Actually, no, it could be on Lips channel, so I never even thought about that. Um, yeah, I'm going to just see real quick with episode 12. Did I do... I think I did, didn't I? Yeah, no, I did the exact same thing. I think... Is this in 1080? Damn, missed opportunity to upload that in 1080 as well. No way. Damn. <laughs> Isn't it strange seeing a new episode of the Nightfire podcast in 2020... A year ago? Wait, I posted... Wait, how long is a year ago? The 19th of March... Oh my god, wow. It's been that long since I did a podcast episode? Damn. 
Definitely next time, though, I do another episode. I gotta do, um... Whatchamacallit? I gotta do a podcast episode where... I fucking have, like, the VTuber model on for it or something like that. And, um... Put things on at the side. And then we need to do a live version at some point as well. Oh, funny thing I seen recently hung up, like... Whatchamacallit? Um... I just, we were just like going around like town and stuff and then you just see randomly like it's like those advertisement signs they have around like when voting takes place for certain things and like it literally was just a sign that just says repent with like a quote unquote scary image of Jesus Christ or something like that on it. I'm just like bruh. That's cringe. Trying to scare people into religion. No wonder you're not fucking taken seriously like. If that's the resource, if that's what you have to fucking go to, to get people to, like, follow your religion, then you've just gone down the rabbit hole too far. You actually need help. Half the time it's just better when you stay in your own lane, and if somebody wants to join you, then welcome them in nicely, you know? Obviously, I wouldn't be a big believer myself anymore, or even just, like, of, um, certain religions, just, especially because, like, I think it was, no, I don't actually, I don't remember anyway, but, yeah, no, I won't talk about it too much in case I, <laughs> just, it's too much of a hot topic, even though I talk about a lot of shit, like, I do know, at the very least, we can have funny moments now, because I know, like, two prayers off by heart, like, so if a scary moment happens in the game, I can say Our Father or Hail Mary. Okay, right, let's try and get myself back in the mood. Come on. Pick it up. Pick up your voice, Guardian. Do better. If you're enthusiastic about it, Guardian, you will make it. Fantastic work. You make Gambit look like shit! Fantastic! Was that all of them? That wasn't all of them! Because, <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't be all the jumps like in the game. Like, I wish it was. I wish we were at the end, but unfortunately we're not. And again, I don't even think we're gonna have a checkpoint in this like the other map, so. Yeah. That's going to be really painful, though. Like, imagine you're at the very tip top. You miss jump from, like, reaching the babe, and you go all the way down back to bog. At least to the section. Like, not bottom of bog, but, like, the top of bog. Even that would be painful in upon itself, honestly. I wouldn't be able to just... I wouldn't take that lightly. I think at that point, I would actually just, like, quit for a bit. Ah, you were moving back slowly by bouncing off it, but then you did that and you just cringe, Guardian. Batman, do you want to know how I got these scars? You see, there's this funny little game called Jump Game, right? And what you do in this game, Batman, is just... You jump. Yes, simply. As a knight, you jump. Just keep going up and up and up until you fall. My friend, Voss, uh, he once told me that insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. And that's exactly what I like about this Jump King Batman. Because you're jumping and jumping and jumping and you fall. And then you're resetting yourself every time. You jump, you jump, and you jump. And then eventually, after so many jumps, you just fall. <laughs> just fucking do it, please! Gonna slide in between? <sighs> Don't say that. Don't do that. That's cringe. If 
If only if I could actually be good at the game, then we wouldn't be here right now. Oh. They had to cut off the worst song in the game, man. No way. <laughs> See what I mean, though? Like, my opinion just changed. Like, I think those are the two variables that change in this game for me. It's that guy at the, like, the pink guy at the end of the last, like, uh, part of the map. Or last part of the section. And then it's the song down there as well. Those two things are always interchanging. Okay, but no, seriously, I am going to do this this time. I've just been trolling everybody the whole time. I know what I'm fucking doing. Like, I've done this before on a different computer. Like, watch this shit. Right, and then you just do that. Then you just do this. You fall. Then you do this, right? It's just, you know, you have to prove, like, it's like maths, right? You have to show you're working. So you just do that. And then you're doing this, right? And you go up to here. Then you go up to there. And then you miss it on purpose, right? So you can do a better jump over. Ah! Oh, I, I, I don't know how I just realized this after all this time. But the reason Chad says that's crazy is because the fucking title of the stream is crazy. I was crazy once. No, I'm sorry, Chad, whenever you were. Like, if you're even still here, I'm sorry that I didn't realize that sooner and I went off on you. God, now I feel even worse. It's like, I said that as the title, like, probably last week. So, like, I, d I didn't even remember that I had it until I started, like, literally open OBS earlier, like. And making the changes to the, um, Cherry Arbor story ads. Which, there are none of those on this stream, Twitch, yes. Nobody sponsoring me. Even if they were, it wouldn't be on this platform, no. I love taking sponsorships directly from Twitch and having them rip money from me, yes. I really hope one of those, like, um, like sex toy companies actually hit me up at some point. <laughs> That'd be so gas. I wish I could get that email as well. Because that's what a lot of VTubers get as well. Like, they get that fucking one, I think it's like a dragon something something company. It's not an ad, by the way. I'm just talking about it. But, like, they're like, oh, we think you'd be perfect for, like, fit for our brand. As, like, literally the VTubers just doing the most wholesome shit on the planet. Like, you made it! Why did you jump? Now you're gonna go bounce off down. Sorry, I'm just typing up a masterpiece right now. If I don't break my keyboard by snapping it in half, I'm gonna break it by smashing the keys in. But yeah. <laughs> no, that actually be too gas. Imagine my workplace actually paid me to advertise <laughs> our workplace. Uh, like, I kind of would love to do that, but like, I'd be kind of doxing where I work. <laughs> so it's like, at the same time, like, at, at, at one point, it's like, yeah, that's cool, but I don't want to dox where I work to people, you know? But yeah, to this day, I haven't gotten a spit of any official, um... Why am I hiccuping again? <sighs> okay. As I was saying, I haven't gotten a official sponsorship, but I've been try. I've have been tempted a few times to try and deal with the um, was the podcast the cold ones podcast done before, where it's like they literally just hit up a bunch of random companies and just ask them if they could sponsor them. Like, I'll just do that for like the um. What you call for a VTuber um, model making commission or VTuber model making company? If there's even any, I'll do that for a PC company. Ask them for the best PC they've got so I can review it. Like honestly, even just like even if I was just like not even paid and just like 
gifted items to fucking review. I would even take that, honestly. Because I think that would make great content, depending on what it is. Like the Dragon Tales. <laughs> Obviously, that wouldn't be on Twitch. That'd be on Kick. It's just like... <laughs> Literally just came to my mind. It's like, well, yeah, I could do that probably. Okay. Like, nah, no, nah, I wouldn't even bother. Like, I I tried to like treat Kick similarly to like Twitch, so I wouldn't start watching The Dark Knight or Breaking Bad on um Kick just because I could. But I'd rather not do that. Like, I wonder if that's like. What XQC has done with Kick is actually making them panic all the time. <laughs> They're like, anytime he streams now, they gotta actually watch him so he doesn't fucking just do something he shouldn't. Like, I had to unfollow him though, like, honestly. I, I didn't want to support that anymore. Oh, that's where I go! Oh my god, I'm such a genius. I am I'm not I'm not Henya, I'm not Henya. Dio. <laughs> okay, no. Now that I know where the fuck I'm going, we have a chance, boys. We have a chance at redemption. Just fucking dox myself accidentally. Hold on, I gotta check what the fuck even came up there. I'm gonna type something. I don't think anything came up there, right? I'm just- I'm gonna just mark this section of the stream just in case. What is it? Three- There's no way we've been going for three hours and a half. Three. There we go. <laughs> just in case I accidentally just docked myself there from spamming the keyboard. See, now I have an excuse not to spam the keyboard so the fucking Windows logo doesn't pop up and do thing. Because honestly, the funniest thing is, I could open settings right now and fucking dox myself. I don't- how the fuck is that even possible? Like, even on Discord, everybody's usernames are, like, shortened. But, like, I, don't, I really don't get how Microsoft can't tell if you're trying to stream or not, like. I haven't put measures in place to try and help hide your, like, personal info whilst you're streaming your PC to others, like. But then again, for someone like Microsoft, they don't really have to bother about that sort of shit. Oh, what? Why? 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 June. So yeah, basically it's gonna be four months since I started working at my workplace. At least in July it will be. Which, that's insane. Because I even kind of remember, because again, I was watching older videos of mine. But I remember making jokes about like how I've been like unemployed for so long and all that and not getting work. Actually no, I only remember that because of the fucking thing stream, the uh, backrooms reaction streams. Where, like, in the stream as well, I mentioned, like, how I was, um, unemployed and still looking for work and stuff. Honestly, I feel like that's a lot of coke for me back then, saying that I was actually searching. If searching counts as, like, looking up a job, like, listing once a month and trying to apply for it, then yeah. I don't really think that's job searching, I think that's just lazy. But to be fair on myself, though, I did actually, you know, eventually get there. Because it was like, one of the things was like, oh, cool, I'm going to the gym this year. I guess I better, um, also, like, fucking do this, too. Like, and that's when I actually, um, whatchamacallit, I also, like, started applying for more jobs and stuff and actually got one. It really just goes to show, if I put enough determination into it, I can actually do it. It's just, I wish I realized that more often, like... Just like with even just making videos and editing videos as well, it's like if I just if I'm just determined to do it, like it'll be better. Like, be better overall. Like, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. What an honor. Happy birthday to you. I still pronounce it as you, but I'm pretty sure everyone else in the series pronounce it as a yo.
You don't know how hard it is, though, to hold in all this frustration for an entire stream and not let it go. Like, I have to let this frustration go, even if it's just slamming my desk, like. At least with me, this is, like, controlled rage and anger. This is not like other people where they completely lose, like, full conscious of self, like. No! Come on, bro! I a poor little cringe. I remember the question that was asked in the like, would you rather? It was like, would you rather speak every language or talk to animals? Honestly, like if I could talk to animals and actually convince them to do shit, maybe animals, but if I couldn't and I could just understand them and talk to them and just be casual with them, then I'd rather just be bilingual. Or not by uh, what would it what would even the term be? Multilingual? Or omnilingual? Like omni be meaning all? <laughs> it's just yeah, literally omnilingual. I'd rather be omnilingual. Because then like I could speak any language I want. Every day of the week, instead of having just an English stream, I'd have multiple different streams and multiple different languages depending on when I stream. So, like, if I was streaming um, later in the night, I'd probably uh, try a different type of stream. If I was st streaming extremely early in the morning, I'd stream in Japanese. And... and then I'd finally be able to learn Irish. I'd finally be able to relate to the few people who actually speak. <laughs> yeah, no, I think, like, and as, as well with being omnilingual, be so handy because then you're like oh i could literally just travel to any country and understand the language like and like this is also assuming that you understand all the nuances of the language the culture and all that sort of shit as well like if you know if you know all that like yeah sure i'm going to japan literally tomorrow like i would actually i would legitimately book a flight to japan and look for time off work like and go that's one of the biggest things that's stopping me from going to Japan. Not even just because I wouldn't have anyone to go with right now. But it's also because of just like... I want to at least learn a little bit of Japanese just before I go. Even just basic stuff. Just so I wouldn't be completely just dependent on like Google Translate. Like. And I feel like if you're going to another country, it wouldn't be any harm to try and learn even like just a few conversational phrases. like, Or not conversational, but like few like easy phrases like or not even easy just like common phrases there we go that's the word ah that's fine wait that fly dropped something hold on okay i don't know if i'm going insane but i swear i saw something up there there's that term that's the determination i've been waiting for man oh my god i, I found it i have a reason now to keep going Actually, about that jobs thing I was mentioning earlier, <laughs> just kick actually do get back to me like, oh yeah, we'll pay you like uh, the minimum wage, like a day or whatever to stream, or minimum wage for every hour you stream, and then over that hours like, hey, <laughs> over that hours it's on you, bro. I really do suck off kick a lot. Yeah, see, there's something up there. Now I actually have a reason to travel. What is that? Bugs no. I think it's pretty clear who won- YOU f YOU MOTHERFUCKER! ARE YOU KIDDING ME?! No- That fly thought I was chasing it the entire time! Nah, if that fucker is actually up there, and he's lying about leaving, I swear to god, man. Now- Now- Okay, now I actually have to get up there just to see if the fly is there. If he's not up in his usual spot he usually goes to, then I'm actually going to be so... Ooh. 
That fellow's been pissing me off for so long and he's only been doing it for a fucking meme, like, because he thought we were playing tag. You're so stupid, mate. You actually thought I actually liked you or something? You thought, like, I was actually playing tag with you? You thought that someone actually would give their, like, fucking interest to your existence? No. Absolutely not. I have a bigger interest in mind. You're literally as small and as insignificant as an actual fly. Why do you think I would give two fucking shits about what you did? The only time I actually paid attention to you is when you dropped that note. If you didn't drop the note, I wouldn't have known you existed, to be perfectly fucking honest with you. Anyway, that's another way to let off rage. It's just the mouth off against an NPC fucking... Uh, just, you know, making fun of you. Sometimes I wish I did have a dog or something. A cat, just to cuddle up with. But then again, I feel like I would squeeze them to death by now. Now just keep going. See, told you. Legit, just keep going. Oh my god, he actually is gone. He wasn't memeing. He actually is fucking gone. Hallelujah. The fly is actually gone. Okay, wait. Did I... I made it over here last time, didn't I? It's just up here I didn't make it to. And then it's over here. Bah, fucker. I know, th this is how I know I've made pro progress. Because I see this fucker down here was like flaunting his feet. Stone was erected by Kurt of Kelp. I didn't even read what I said before. Be thankful her spirit remains. Visiting us day after day after all this time. It is proof that she is alive and well. We must be thankful. I say that you say that now as you're dead. Okay, but how do I how do I reach this fucker without Oh, I'd actually have to throw just to fucking reach him. Nah, fuck that. I'm not doing that. Wait, how do... How do I get up? Oh, maybe I do have... Wait, because if I... No, I can from here, right? Ooh, okay, I made it. Somehow. Okay. I think it is up to the left-hand side. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna have to make it over to the other side, aren't I? Okay. These are fucking risky jumps. Okay, there we go. Oh, I don't like that. We're approaching an area that looks like it's snowing. I don't like that at all. I do not like the looks of that. Zoink scoops. The radar is going off, man. You have to be a bit lighter with these jumps. Especially because there. Actually, this is... Oh, it's not full! Oh my god. Okay, wait. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, stop throwing, Joe. Stop. No, seriously, stop. Stop actually throwing. You're throwing. Okay, what's up here? Oh, wait. This is... Oh, no. No, Joe. It's not a checkpoint. Look at the left-hand side. This is not a checkpoint, bro. Are you kidding me? My biggest fear in my head came true! We're reaching that. We are reaching that. I've made new progress today. And see, this is this is what I was talking about at the start of the stream. Once I make new progress, I fucking thirst over it more than the fucking simp, like. I swear to god. And now that the fly is out of the picture, it makes the game ten times better. Honestly, his existence is what really was hindering me this entire time. The moment the fly left, our existence is the moment we got better at the game. Trust me on that one. I cannot even cope even more than I can by saying that that fly was a hindrance to our progress. And now that the fly is gone, I'm so happy. I actually could actually just completely just cry tears of joy from how happy I am that the fly is gone. I swear this fly would have taken my family or something and that's why I'm just raging about him so much. 
Oh, that's cringe. Oh, that, that's cringe. Oh, that's just cringe, man. That's cringe! That is so bad. That is cringe. Hi, ghost. How's it going? Even though, I'll be honest, I don't really want to be down here anymore. I see a snow cabin. Oh, my... So, okay. So, wait. It's a snow cabin. I love the way... The moment I mentioned snow cabin, I'm like, oh, wait. Yeah, it's a snow cabin. My brain pieced that together before I actually pieced it together myself, like... My left hand side of the brain piece that together before the right hand side. I mean, as long as the snow is remaining on the outside, I'm happy with that, honestly. But I feel like this next section is going to be a pain in the arsehole, though. Oh yeah, now that I've passed that, well, not passed that section, but now that I've like reached a high, like whenever anybody's around again, I can ask them for tip, like hints and tips now. Until the very tip top of the map. That's when I'll stop, like, taking in tips and tricks. Okay, to be fair, I'm only scared there because, like, if I do it too, like... If I do it wrong, then I just... I'm wrong. I hate being wrong. Nobody likes to be wrong, to be honest. And if you do, then... I guess there's reasons. I can kind of see them now. Why are you pressing this button? No, 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 no. You're trying to just... You're trying to get me down to bog. I know what you're up to. I've seen my full potential. You cannot hold me from it. I will actually desolate this entire map. Just to visit this last babe. You do not, do not underestimate my power. I am a god in my own right. I am the god of this world, and I will rule it. Hardships make the god. Co 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 co. Mmm, <laughs> salty. <laughs> There's a descriptor nobody needs to know about my hands. At least they're not. Actually, yeah, they're not. Okay, now that I'm realizing, yeah, they kind of are sweating a little bit, but they're they're only a bit dry because the fans on behind me and like they're just drying the tops of my hands. The opposite side of my hands, like the opposite palm. There we go. Why are palm trees called palm trees? Or is it called palm wood? That's why it's palm trees. You know, instead of asking these stupid questions on stream, I could just like look them up in my own time. But no, I have to be uh, a doofus. <laughs> I'd rather that, honestly. I'd rather this, honestly. I'd rather do this than make progress in the game, you know? Like, it's just it's how it is. Oh, hey, God, how's it going? Sorry, I'm just lurking because I'm kind of busy today. In a bit, I will have some time. Yeah, honestly, God, you don't need to apologize for something like that. If you have time, you have time. I will tell you, though, before, like, you uh, continue with your busy stuff. I did, like, I seen the next section. We're making progress today. I have seen the next section. I almost was in the next section. I just missed it by a jump. And I would have been, like, in it. Uh, you've seen cats. I have not seen cats. I have seen snow. Um, whatchamacallit. I have, uh, seen a cabin kind of, like, area, I think it was. And the fly that was, uh, in the fly area, um... They're a little cheeky bastard. They thought I was playing tag with them the whole time. Oh, hi, ghost. Bye, ghost. Because they actually... They fucking... Yeah, no, look. Bugs know. Inspect. I think you're... It's pretty clear who won here. Hee <laughs> hee, smell you later. Like... He's just irrelevant, bro. He's so irrelevant. Can you tell Rice Gum's my idol? Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Because I keep failing this map! I chased that ass. Um. Oh yeah, bug no, yeah. Oh, sorry, I didn't even read that before. Yeah. No, I just had to reconfirm that I wasn't the only one saying it. I've had to do a lot of that recently about reconfirming stuff in existence. <laughs> but now he's gone, and the game- Legit, not even joking, when the fly left, that's when I got better. That's when I actually reached a new section of the game. <laughs> it's like, unironically, the fly was actually holding me back. Anyway, sorry, I'll let you go, God. I know, like, you said you were busy, so... I won't hold you too much longer, I just have to get off of my chest. Oh, why am I doing that? Isn't it kind of just suspicious? How I don't go, oh, no, I go, ah. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, that was even more sus than what I usually do. Okay, no, I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna completely just shut my mouth and try and reach that section. No problem, right now I have some minutes, but I will leave the house in a bit. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Honestly, at this rate, you're not going to see me get into the next section, but it's okay. Because hopefully in the next stream, I'll be progressing more through the uh, next section of the game. I'm just happy enough that I've actually reached the next section, because I actually was really doubting I was going to reach it, honestly. Wait, what? How did you do that? Why did you only realize that now? I've been jumping to the other side and sliding when I could just go there instead. I I have some explaining to do to myself. Okay, this ain't this ain't that bad. She's a 10, but she likes single player games. So yay, what about that single player mode you got in that game, huh? What are you saying about that, huh? See, I'm oh, what? now I'm going back down there. My brain is a mysterious organism. What are you doing? I need to get that to be a soundbite as well. When I screamed in the, um, We Are Number One cover, like, What are you doing? <laughs> Except I wouldn't keep all that in because I just keep, like, the because you can't really hear the song at that point. I've made some a lot of memeable moments over time. I need to bring them forward into the sound bites. Or the uh, soundboard. And then maybe even some notifications like should be swapped to them, like I was saying earlier about the um what I was talking about one earlier, I can't remember now. But I was saying like the raid sound or something, or the follower sound should be like <laughs> No! That would be so good. Just every time somebody follows, it's just me screaming, No! Don't follow! What are you doing? You're making a horrible choice in your life. Principal, he should have this. I don't know why, I'm in such a fucking laughing mood now. <laughs> I didn't think the insanity would be burrowing this deep inside of me. I just feel laughy now all the time. Wait, isn't that the name of the duck in, like, Looney Tunes? Laffy? Or Daffy? It's Daffy, isn't it? No, I swear it's Laffy. No, it's Daffy. No, Daphne is, like, Scooby-Doo. Laffy Duck. Yeah, it's laughing, right? I'm actually going pure schizo mode right now. Okay, no, here it is, here it is, here it is, here it is. This is it, this is it. I'm feel- okay, I'm, okay, that, that was a lie. I was just- I was just capping because of my nose itch. Mm. No, but seriously, this is it, this is it. Th this is going to be the one. I'm going to reach the next section and it's going to be beautiful. I'm not going to stop there though, I'm going to fall back down into bog at the end of this when I reach up there and it's going to be so beautiful. Why did you do that? 
Actually, I should go the other end, because I think that's guaranteed... Well, actually, you were too late to do that now. But, like, in future, you should do that, because it actually more guarantees that you'll get onto the platform without sliding off it. But anyway, we're up here, and we're going to do... <coughs> Instead of a no scream, use the scream from the Air Zone commercial. I sent you a DM with a link to it, Lamar. Oh, let me listen to this. Where's my thing? When you see that, when you say DM, do you mean on Discord? I mean, actually, no. You mean a whisper, right? On <coughs> Twitch. Ignore my uh, throat giving out. My throat doesn't like living anymore. Dun, dun, dun. Is Iron Mouse still doing her subathon, bro? Oh yeah, day thirty, and she's like, "We're day ending it with a bang." Oh. Fair play. Um. Oh yeah, there it is. I see it there. I think that was the first time I've actually seen your profile picture now that I realize it. Isn't that... That's like a Japanese show, isn't it? Like a... I think... I think Thing did a collab with them once. <clears throat> Let me see this. Are you ready? Oh, Crayon Shin-chan, yeah. I just remember seeing it somewhere before, probably in a meme or something like that. So wait, is it that little part at the end I should be using the fucking... No, our zone. Our zone, our zone. What even is this? Is this like a console? Tiger our zone commercial. Seems to have bought this thing together with the Batman and Robin cartridge. It was easy, the biggest purchase I'd made up to that point, and it was traumatic to discover just how shitty this thing was and what a fool I was for buying it. Thank God uh, Zellers had a generous return policy. Okay, that it has just mumbles. Your terror. Uh, the scream starts at 24 seconds. Uh, do you know Tiger Electronics? I don't actually know. Oh, this is the part you're on about. Hold on, let me full screen this. So you're on- oh wait, hold on. Let me hide the, uh... Where is it? There it is. You mean this part here, right? It's ah! All of our zone cartridges play on the R zone- I would base boost that as well. Not even base boost it, but I'd increase the volume of it as well. Sorry, I see Nags, so I'm just gonna add that. Yeah, haha. Ha. I'll, uh, I'll see... thing, whatchamacallit. Your DM is there, so if I ever think about it again and I really want to change that, I will probably change that. Because I did update the soundboard. It has another one or two new uh, sounds after I remove sounds. I think I removed the uh, Sherry Aubrey story sound or something like that. Um. Yeah, sorry, my brain just froze. So Tiger Electronics are these Game Boy knockoffs with calculator graphics. I mean, I saw from there, they look very high quality to me. <laughs> Um, but yeah. Oh my god, phone guy singing another song. Oh, excuse me. Um, sorry, I've been just in my own world there for a minute. Jesus, All right? Let me just close this out before I forget what I'm doing. What my goal is today. Um, and the Arizona is a head strap with a tiny screen attached to it, so you can play those terrible games on an even smaller screen. Damn. Makes sense. I guess at the time, like, there was a lot of competition. Or not a lot of competition, but there were knockoff competitions. And, like, even during that time, people probably didn't even predict that, like, Sega would just go uh, and turn into a, um, whatchamacallit, a gaming company. And not just, you know, basically not have the, what was it, the Sega Dreamcasts anymore. People probably thought it was going to be, like, Sega versus Nintendo versus Sony or something like that. Why did I jump off that, by the way? Why do I have to throw this hard for content? Like, this isn't even funny anymore. This is actually concerning. 
I need to go to a therapist after dropping down here, like. There we go. Like, now I have to do all this section and all next section all over again. Just because I'm incompetent, like. I guarantee somebody who's like, like really good at jumping could actually complete the game a hundred times over before I even complete this. They could probably complete all three maps a hundred times over before I complete this, like, and they could take breaks in between as well. They could go to Hawaii for a week and they still, like, I still wouldn't be able to do it, like. But I do find that kind of funny though, especially when I drop like this and I want to slam my keyboard but I'm scared I might accidentally dox myself by like bringing up the Windows key like I did before and probably accidentally doxing something. I don't even know if I did, I probably didn't. Or I might have spoiled something because like a lot of recent files you work on does show up as well when you press the like Windows key and go a certain sector. I kind of wish I could, like, get drunk. Do I, though? <laughs> Do you, Joe? Interesting thought process. I mean, at least then I'd actually be fucking belly aching laughing, like. Belly ache laughing, there we go. Because, like, I'm really fucking social when I'm, like, had a few drinks in me, like. I've become an extrovert, essentially, like. And I understand now why my mate, like, who couldn't, like, talk to me for a long time, literally talked to me because he was, like, drinking, like, it does something to you. But at the same time, when I'm at home, I don't really drink a lot, like, I'd rather be out drinking with the boys. Wait, put a Stella, mate, wait. No, I actually don't even think I drink Stella, to be honest. I don't even know what Stella is. I think it's an ale, isn't it? That I probably won't like. I don't think I like ales, to be honest. I'm more of a cider guy. Up we go. Up we go. I think for, like, from now on, I might just turn all the fucking content warnings off. Because, like, what's the point of them, honestly? All of Twitch is like this, like... Why did I? I was literally in the perfect spot and I did that, man. Wait, what time is it? Half eight. Now, I feel like if I genuinely start, like, even just having one drink right now. Because I feel like, a, like, at one point, like, I did have a bit too much in my drink. And I was actually kind of getting a bit lightheaded. But I think that was also a combination of the heat as well, to be honest. And then also just non-stop staring at my phone. Dun, 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 dun. Which actually I didn't even mention, but that's the reason why I wasn't even streaming yesterday. A game called uh, Love Live School Idol Festival All Stars was shutting down uh, yesterday, so I was like, I'm gonna play all day uh, yesterday, do as much as I can in the game before it shuts down. Honestly, in a sense, like, I do miss it, but I, I'm kind of glad it shut down at the same time. Because now it's so interesting that, like, because I woke up this morning and the first thing I did was check my phone for the game. And obviously, it said, yeah, service terminated, obviously. <laughs> they didn't just change their mind at the last second. And, um, yeah, no, it's just weird, like, having a game like that be in your life for, like, three, three and a half years, I think it was, for global users. And then just having it just not be there anymore is just weird. And like, I don't even really want to replace it with a game right now. Not that because there's going to be another game of it coming out soon, but... Just because, again, I want to just see what life is like without just... Going on to the game every morning and afternoon and night. Because even when I, like, go down, I'm like, oh yeah, shit, I don't have really that game to look at anymore. I do know, though, they did say, the developers, they posted, like, one last note at the last second, I think, before I even saw it. 
where they were mentioning that they do want to save a lot of the in-game content somehow. Now, whether they'll fall through with it, though, I don't know. And whether they're just saying it to try and make people feel better about it, I don't know. I feel like the best way they can save it is literally by just making a port of the game. Because, I mean, all those 3D models and stuff are going to waste, like... At least with the old game, there's, like, the sequel game. That continues the old game, in a sense. So, there's not really... You're not really missing out on the old game too much, like... Because 1 and 2 are kind of the same thing, just UI differences, really. But with this one, like, you're missing out on the models and the concerts and all that. Like, all the work that went into it, and it's just all just deleted. It would be perfect, though, for a port. Especially because it's more of a modern game as well. Unlike the other game they ported before from the arcade. Where the models just looked weird to me because I was so used to seeing the, um the all-star version of the models and they just look so much better. But now I understand why the models in the arcade port aren't that good. <clears throat> it's because they're based off of old models that were made ages ago. But they ported like all-star, that'd be madness. Hopefully though, if they do port it, they port it to everything and not just fucking PlayStation like they did with the arcade one. Basically, just don't let it be in the hands of Square Enix, like, for fuck's sake. <laughs> please, just trust the people you're looking at making that, like, um, spin-off game, please. Somehow make them do it, like, trust them, and, like, if they make it well, if the game does well, then hey, trust them more often, and then maybe we can actually get the game on other, like, devices. Because I would love a PC port of the game. I would love to fucking mod the shit out of the game. I always say about this modding and stuff, I rarely mod games, it's really Minecraft the only thing I've modded just with shaders, but I would try and somehow mod like <laughs> VTuber models into the game, like then I could recreate Sherry as a VTuber and then have her in there and then have her like sing and dancing or something like that. That'd be so good. By the way, Twitch, that is not an ad for Sherry Opera Story, the light level series I'm currently working on. I'm just casually mentioning it. <laughs> I'm not paying myself to mention all this shit. I do that on purpose, by the way. I know Twitch don't really give a shit, but at the same time, I'll be a lot more cautious tomorrow. But to be honest, I do kind of want to do that Junk King stream, though. I kind of want to do one on Kick. So I might look into that multi-streaming service and see how that goes. See if I can start streaming on YouTube and Kick at the same time so I can save the VOD. And just so, like, I can be, like... <laughs> I can actually, like, make the stream title be the best, um, jumping player on kick. <laughs> That'd be so gas, because I wouldn't technically be wrong, because I'd be the only guy streaming on, like, jumping, um... Kicks, jumps... Kicks, jump, king, category. There you go. You swear I was already drunk with the way I talk. No. Yamate Kurasai. Bum 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 da 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 We're back in Fly Central, or Bookstock. I say Fly Central, but the fellow's gone, so. And they're actually a bug, because it's called Bugs Note Joe, so. Maybe stop calling them a fly? That's kind of speciesist, to be honest with you. Like, and I don't really appreciate that tone. I had to cut that off early because I knew it was going to do that. Like, you just realize now, Joe, that you're good at the game and you have to throw like this, man? No way. Absolutely. See, like, I'm even nerfing myself. I'm jumping where I shouldn't, well, falling off where I shouldn't, like. I should already be done the game. No cap. I should be done. <laughs> Definitely. God, my nose. Why? Why now? Like, bro. Give over. Your job is to protect my nose from shite trying to get into my nose. Why are you like this?
Okay, so clearly that jump does not fucking work, Joe. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> oh, why, thank you. I wish I could have that as a sound alert so badly, but it's fucking copywritten, like... I guarantee, like, it would be copywritten, like, when I use it on... Uh, uh, saying every fucking word other than uh, uh, you... <laughs> Twitch! Jesus! That's the word I'm looking for! Fucking hell, man! And now it is time for my keyboard to be smashed. Mate, I'm going to be so much more comfortable up in the cabin in the snow. You're actually going to have to look at the view from up there to, like, prove me wrong. And say that down here is more comfortable than up there. Sorry, mate. Not listening to you anymore. L plus ratio plus you're sitting at the bottom of bog. That's fucking cringe. I'm actually going to break this keyboard without snapping it in half. That's going to be my magic trick for tonight. <laughs> oh. Welcome back to the mysterious stream where he's going to somehow break his keyboard without snapping it in half. Why? 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 Just uh, no, 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 seriously, answer me this. Why are you doing this? Like, what do you get from this, Joe? Why, why, why do this? Is there a reason? Do you need to go have a checkup with your therapist? Are you good, my G? Daijo Boo? Again, I swear no other game has made me break down this much other than fucking this, like, I swear. Jump King is just probably the first game to ever break me this much. Even though I feel like there probably were other games that have broken me before in the past, I just haven't expressed it in this way before. Which is a lot more reserved and not as, uh confident to just voice how I'm internally doing. You just realized that you are not subscribed. And plain shit- nah. <laughs> I said it wrong anyway. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching the stream. Today's stream is sponsored by absolutely nobody because uh, Twitch has ruined my chances to ever have sponsorships in the future. Thank you very much. You know, that is actually kind of the funniest part as well. Like, I could probably get, like... Well, anyone can get sponsorships probably before they, like, join the uh, Twitch Bounty Board program, assumingly. But because, like, they've made... are going to make the changes tomorrow, that's actually probably going to fuck over a lot of people, like... And now their income has been hit, and that's why so many, like, kick accounts were made recently. Because, you know, they want to continue that sponsorship, but, like, they have to do it on a different platform now to make sure they can continue doing those sponsorships. Like, social medias just need to learn that if you don't let your creators do what they want, they're going to revolt. One, some, at some point, I think the next new platform that's going to come up has to be a Reddit clone. Has to be. Especially with the way Reddit's been treating everyone. Like, or the CEO. The CEO is actually, like, probably the worst CEO of a company we've probably seen. And I know people call, like, Susan Wojcicki bad, but at least she fucking tried to look good, like. Not like you're one that's Reddit CEO. They're just, like, people? Why do I care about them? I want money. At least I'm honest about liking money, but I also like people as well, you know? Because at least I'd understand that the base value, like, if people weren't here, I literally would not be streaming right now. It's only because, like, people are here 
I do turn up, but I'm like still streaming and stuff. I'm not even that, actually. I think I still would stream, actually, even without people. But having people here is also a good motivator. But it's not a good motivator when you can't make it out of the pop section of the map! I'm also thinking about, like, if I move place, imagine if I couldn't scream like I do anymore. I, that would actually just, that, I'd actually have to form a complaint, like, actually, this is a part of my job, so I kind of have to scream at the top of my lungs that I'm going to fucking dick down so be sister? Like, you know how it is. Oh, for fuck's sake. I actually always view that prospect as being weird though. Like imagine you do get with like your friends, like sibling, whether they're older or younger. That's just a weird like dynamic, isn't it? You're friends, but you also have like, you're also friends with your like friends as like sibling. It just wouldn't work out. Like, unless all of you are already friends, but, like, if you're not already friends, like, it just, it's awkward. You know? And especially if, like, the siblings don't actually get along that well as well. That's even more awkward, like. Oh, you're gonna... Never mind. Joe, you're too good at the game. For fuck's sake, actually just quit. Sit, no, stop. You're making everybody cry with this incredible gameplay, like. Can you do the gritty for us? Oh shit, no, he's doing the gritty! I say, when I say everybody's crying, I'm kind of crying right now. <laughs> like, legit, every so often tears will kind of start forming in my eyes. I don't know if that's actually a problem or if that's a good sign. I guess the emotions have no other way of conveying themselves, so I have to fucking cry. So if you jump over here, right, that's a good thing, because you're going to jump over here and then fall to your fucking doom! But then you're saved because the universe actually likes you? Like, what? And then you fuck it up, because why not? How, how okay no guarantee I, I got saved twice here but I'm gonna fuck it over I, I I legitimately guarantee no I'm I'm already fucking it up no Joe up oh, oh you fucked it you've actually fucked it how did you they, they gave you two chances and you fucked up both the chances how how are you actually kidding me. The game gave you two chances, and you still fucked up. <laughs> Just that awe with how, like, amazing I am at this game. I seriously need to consider, like, getting better at the game. <laughs> I feel like there's only so, like, often I can fucking, um, repeat a phrase before it just, even I get sick of saying it, like... Oh my god, guys! We're actually flipping burgers! I actually saw the original video where that was from again, and I was like, Oh my god, this is where I got that clip of myself from. I remember now. It was a video titled, like, Work Experience. I don't even know if it's still up on the channel, but... Yeah. That part in the video in particular was gas. Oh no, wait, no, it wasn't the Work Experience video. It was the, um... What's we call it? It was the radio debut. That's the one. The work experience there at the radio. Which that is so weird to think about. Like I've, I'm pretty sure my face is meant to be in a newspaper somewhere, but I haven't seen it yet. And I can't even explain why, which is the saddest part. But you're just gonna have to believe me on that. So of all of, of all the transport methods I've used in life, I think I've used like most of them. And then out of like. All the media in life, I've only not been on, like, TV. I think that's the only thing I haven't been on yet.
And when I say that in some terms of media, I mean like in terms of my actual face, like you know, well, I say I'm because radio doesn't really count. It's my voice, but still. I don't know if the radio station I was on have archives of their thing. I would actually go search for that, like, uh, whatchamacallit, that day of the radio, like, just to see if I can find myself. Actually, yeah, it's not, I think I did, like, two or three segments as well when I did work experience there, so. Like, legit, being a YouTuber at the time actually came in handy. <laughs> That's actually gas when you think about that. Like, the reason that I, like, could do it is literally because I already had that experience of being on a mic because of YouTube, like. I don't think I had the experience of live streaming properly just then, but even then, like, it was still handy. I just want to keep repeating, oh my god, guys, we're actually flipping burgers! Like the video! Oh, this not, this not gonna end well. No, I'd rather I'd legit rather jump down than fucking fall down to the bottom, honestly. That's just my genuine opinion though on the fucking state of the game. We still got another 30 hours to go. No, sorry. 30 plus hours to go. Before I even get anywhere near to completing this map. But it's good to know I made a little bit of progress. Cause a little bit of Monica in my life. A little bit of Monica by my side. A little bit of Monica who I am. A little bit of Monica, yes we go. A little bit of Monica. Once you reach cats, I may give you tips for book stock. Honestly, even now you can kind of just give tips for it. Because, as I said, I was literally almost in. I literally just... Basically, just don't, when I'm up there, just don't give tips about, like, when I'm about to enter the next section. Like, the cross section between the two, uh, sections of maps. Or not maps, but sections. The two, the cross section of the sections. Or the area, there we go, that's a better word. Because saying sections and sections is confusing. And what's even more confusing is how my brain cells have actually not come back from strike yet. Like, who needs a workers' union anyway, like? <laughs> Such a fucking stupid sentence, huh? I remember, actually, the, that video I was looking about earlier on, um, quiet quitting and all that. Like, fucking boomers were raging about that fucking trend, because, it, like, there's even one guy that was like, Alright, oh, you, you wanna yeah, do a bit of different bits, and you know, I need a lazy board, and you fucking, uh, you quitter, and you let it, <laughs> Okay, Boomer. I'll be happy to watch your business burn to the ground. Even though, like, I never even realized I was particip going to participate in it, but I feel like now it's just reconfirmed to me that I kind of uh, might be a quiet quitter going forward in the future for work. Because basically what it is, it's like, you essentially just do your job as it is, even though for my job I kind of go overboard because like I like working at my job, but basically it's just like, after like I'm done for like maybe even half a year, so like August, September time, I'm probably going to find another job, work at that for a little bit, then find another job and keep bouncing from there, you know? So I feel like that's the best thing you can do to keep yourself stimulated in life. It's constantly bounced from jobs, especially for someone like me, who doesn't really, like, I'm not going to be suffering financially anytime soon, so, like, I can afford to do it, you know? It's time to get up here and I'll read exactly what you're saying. Um, so, okay, we'll start at the first screen, then once you're there... Sorry, I was just raging as I fucking fell to the bottom. Uh, that must be nice to have that kind of freedom. It is, yeah. Because to be honest, I, I like I know I meme about it a little bit that I'm not going to be able to do stuff until I'm 30, but it's kind of true, honestly. I'm never going to be able to buy my own house at this rate. And that's kind of sad. Even, like, if I was living with people, I would just, I'd be so financially scared to do anything. I would probably on purposely not eat as much because, like, I know it would fucking eat into our bottom line of money, like... I would literally abuse my workplaces like coffee and like um, biscuit standards and I would just make sure like by the time I leave all them biscuits and coffee are gone <laughs> and I won't tell anybody that I did it like 
I would have to just do it to survive. But even now, like, the only reason I'm really streaming right now is because I don't have, like, that worry of, like, shit, I need to, like, be doing this, this, and this. I still live at home. Even though some people do seem it as shameless, but, like, at the same time, like, you don't have a choice, like... I, I don't have a choice but live with my parents. I wish I could move out. I wish I could have my own house. I wish I could be grander in my ambitions, but... Just, you know, life just is like this right now, so you kind of just have to deal with it, you know? Was it me? I don't know what was it me. Oh, the biscuits, yeah. Yeah, that's an, a good recreation of myself. To be fair, though, like, when I go to my workplace and I see milk from last week still in the fridge, I'm kind of tempted to just do thing, like, honestly. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Dead, you're here for the first time in a while and Automod's caught you. Let's see. Hello? <laughs> just, okay, I'm allowing this one. This is gas. <laughs> it's just permitting a bunch of... T Wait, where's your comment gone? Oh, I wanted to read the whole thing out. Oh, fuck's sake. Uh, here, um... Dead, you won't be able to, like, copy and paste the exact same thing you just said there somehow. <laughs> you said something about fucking... Like, literally, you were just saying every single swear word or something under the sun, like... But yeah, I know, it's like Twitch's new thing. I, I'm probably gonna just turn it off, honestly, after this stream. So I've already turned the 18 plus thing off because I'm not really playing an 18 plus game. And at the same time, like, I don't know. So I mean, not I don't think anyone else really follows the same kind of time. Like, they're kind of just there in case you know you're always going to be like that. Like, maybe one day we'll have a Jump King stream where I'm not raging, like, you know, thing. I'll copy it, don't worry, thank you. Because I don't know why, it deleted it afterwards. Because it just says I permitted the terms, but it didn't, like, actually post a comment. I clicked allow it, not fucking add it. <laughs> okay, wait, no, hold on. I'll read it out this time, and I'll copy it myself so I can paste it. Oh no, significant sexual or profanity used in stream. What will I ever do? Oh, fucker mother. Shit ass whore, motherfucking cunt. Allow? There we go! That's it. There you go, dead. I will put your art piece on display. But yeah, how's it going, dead? It's been a while. Don't mind me just slowly losing my sanity. And conversing with God themselves. Actually, that, I just realized how funny that is. I say something like that, and I'm just like, I was talking about a little bit about religion earlier and how I don't really believe in certain things, and it's like, oh god. God, please don't smite me. Up we go. There we go. Lovely. Yes. I think, I wonder, it can't have been because I raised that, because... I'm trying to think. I I raised a um auto mod thing recently. But it wasn't for that. It wasn't for swearing. Like for swearing there shouldn't even be a like thing on for that. I think maybe it just detected aggression or something. Like in the fucking uh like comment you made and that's why I flagged it because it's all caps. Cuz like when I when I look at the swearing auto mod setting, oh shit, why did I do that? When I looked at the auto mod swearing yoke, it's saying, um, or it did say, like, um, uh, no filter. So, yes, is it going? Oh, you're only losing it. Oh, yeah, no, I'm only losing my mind. That's all. Like, nothing that mad, you know, to be honest. I can't remember what I was saying, so. I love the way the moment I point out that I'm making a suspicious sound, it just gets even more suspicious. Oh, you know, actually, that would be a gas fucking thing to do together. Like, I know I was already going to do the Terraria thing, and I haven't gone back to it since, and the Minecraft thing at some point I should do. Fucking Among Us. <laughs> we're just doing Among Us thing where we're just constantly fucking gaslighting each other, like... Because that's all really Among Us is. It's literally just gaslighting each other into thinking that you're in the right or they're in the wrong. Even though we'd probably have to play OG Among Us for a little bit because I'm fucking very rusty at 
Oh, why am I doing this? I'm very rusty at Among Us because of the thing. Um, I've already lost it, and yeah, the point it was, it was meant to, to be aggressive swearing, yeah. Because I'm pretty sure for aggression, it is on a little bit, but not like all the way. All the way for auto mod settings is like four, but it's currently on one, I think. Like most things are on one, except, um, as I said, swearing. Swearing should be not on, uh, it shouldn't even be on one in the first place. Damn, that's why I'm good at it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, there you go. That's it. Oh, no, this is this is actually just delectable. This is delicious. Are you fine with my awkward explanation of full jumps, or would you rather jump on Discord for a few minutes? Uh, I'll be grand with your awkward explanations. Oh. Until I actually reach the section as well, like, I, I feel like I'm not even going to reach back up. Like, I was doing so well, and then Bog was like, yo, how's it going? Ireland missed me so much that I had to just drag me back down to it, like. But soon. It's going to be like a big coming soon. No, wait, 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 wait. I feel like I'm going to hit the thing. Am I going? I think I am going insane. Yeah, no, we should be fine. There you go. Um, I'd be never know. Maybe I'll change my mind. Once you get to manor, it shouldn't take too long. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, it shouldn't. Yeah, it shouldn't. It shouldn't. I know you're just on about your explanation, but I saw too long and I fell. <laughs> it's just like, hmm, yes, too long. My soul ass man Thank you Finally all oh, my fucking things to Oh let's go <laughs> with disappointment Uh Yeah no maybe I should have listened to God and Fab about getting the uh, the fucking snake ring but at the same time I just didn't want to at the time Actually, was I more mentally unstable then than I am now? Because I feel like now I'm very mentally unstable. I feel like I'm actually going to, like... If I say it, I'm going to break the keyboard, but I never will. And I'm saying that now that I never will so that people can, like, you know, clip that in the future. And then it's just, like, cuts to me just breaking the keyboard, snapping it in half. Over we go. Okay, Joe, 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 the game is giving you a chance. Utilize it. Please. For fuck's sake! What are you doing? <laughs> it says VTuber and your tags five times. Does it seem sane to you? Absolutely. Now, I was thinking, actually, I gotta remove the, um, thing soon, like, I actually gotta remove the, um, what should we call it, the Irish ones, cause, like, they're not really needed there. EN VTuber is enough, honestly. Bro, mentally unstable. Man, I'm just unstable with depression. Rest in peace. I would say I am depressed, but I'm more just confused nowadays. Of what I want to do and stuff. In a weird way, streams is kind of an escape from that. But at the same time, I am genuinely thinking proper of my future. Just, I need to give it time for it to actually come to fruition before I can start making different moves. That's why I mentioned again the quiet quit and shit and about like moving jobs and stuff. But in my case, it'd be more of like, I get a part-time job somewhere else and then branch out from there. And then probably quit my old job and get a full-time job where I get a part-time job. And then move on from there and see how that goes. It would be nice to get another job to see what it's like. Because, as, again, as much as I do like my workplace, like... There is something about the monotony of, like, doing the same shit day in, day out that's probably going to get to me. 
that's why I think I hated school so much, is literally because, like, it's the same... Well, not even the same shit. It's just, like, shit I didn't really want to do over and over. But then again, that's not to say I don't want to do work stuff at work, but, like... I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Yeah. You're from Ireland. Yes, I am indeed. Well, I'm living in Ireland. If it, that's more accurate. I'm half Irish, half uh, English. Or British, if you want to be more funnier. So I can say the bottle of water meme. You know? I'm not depressed. I'm... So, um, uh, shit. Too far. Reject humanity. Go, go to monkey. Nah, no. If you were suicidal... You definitely would have to reach out to the available helplines. I think, actually, if you look up, like, Minecraft hanging sign or something on Bing, it actually does come up with fucking, like, suicide helplines. It's like, that, that Bing, that, that's not kind of what they were looking for, but that is helpful information. I'm pretty sure even on, like, a YouTube video, if you start talking about stuff like that, it actually comes up as a little prompt at the bottom of the video. Just like if you mention, like, COVID-19 in your title, description, or tags, it'll actually put, like, a little info docket about COVID-19 below the video. Which I kind of like that it has information like that. But the one I like the most about giving information is the fucking Twitter ones. Because they're always so gas. Like, someone on Twitter will be chatting shit about something. And then the fucking, literally right below it, Twitter will correct and be like, actually, that's not what happens. Uh, they're lying, piece of shit, like. And it's always so gas to see, like. So if you post a picture of, um... If you post a picture of your girlfriend, quote-unquote, there may be a chance if your tweet pops off, Twitter might actually fact correct, or fact check you. And they're like, actually, this is a very popular image used amongst people who do not have a partner in life. But yeah, it's gosh, yeah. Oh my god. Almost there as well, man. Literally a few jumps off. To be honest, I should get help. Honestly, yeah, you should. And don't listen about all that shit about, like, men needing to bottle up all their shit and all that all the time. Honestly, I wouldn't even have my greetings in real life be like, hey, uh, if I didn't, like, you know, just branch out and be more like myself. I feel like it is very important to, like, especially as a man, to, like, express your emotion stuff. And even if you're not, just in general as a person, just, like, taking care of yourself mentally and doing the right things to further, like help yourself in life even though it does sound kind of, it does sound selfless when i say that or selfish but at the same time you have like if you don't care for yourself like and you don't have anyone else caring for yourself who's going to care for you then like you're leaving nobody to care for yourself that's why every so often like even right now i'm already thinking about it i'm like you know i might just buy myself that netflix treat myself for a little bit you know that's me even just doing a little bit to just you know, take care of myself and do stuff that I want to do. I like being independent because I can do shit by myself and I can actually take care of myself as well. If I had my own house, I'd definitely learn quickly on how to do it. Anyway, I'm going on a fucking tangent. But yeah, basically just take care of yourself. Because it's not enough anymore now to just take care of yourself physically. You have to take care of yourself mentally as well. That's the whole reason Jacksepticeye went through that PMA phase, like, long ago. And he probably still believes into that, in that in a certain degree nowadays, like, so it does matter a lot. I actually remember I made a video in relation to that ages ago, the PMA uh, stuff. Positive mental attitude. Even though it's not, like, it's not even just a case about always being positive and having a positive mental attitude. It's also about, you know, sometimes you got to learn there is, like, down times you will have with yourself. And that's okay. Sometimes you're just gonna have that shit day. You just get through it and you go on to the next day, you know? Sorry, anyway, I'm just, yeah. To be honest, I'm better than actually attempting, but, like, still bad. Um. Yeah. I th honestly, the easiest thing, even, I know it's ironic for me to say, because I don't really talk to a lot of people a lot of the time, but even just talking to random people about shit, like, or well, not random people, but talk to people you know. Especially if you just have weights you just want to get off for a minute. And that doesn't mean you can just search about trauma dumping on me, but... And what I mean is just basically, like... Again, taking care of yourself. Not keeping stuff bottled up and all that. So that means I gotta do this for a second. 
Nerd. <laughs> the perfect timing! Just slams the desk. Nerd. Sorry, I had to do that because I was making a point there of just like, not bottling in your emotions, let them out. And you know what? Monitor, you're next. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. I'm not going to punch the monitor in. Um, but how's Jump King? Um, what's in my mouth? What the fuck? Oh, he's fucking doing that. Jeez. Um, it's uh, not going too well. But, you know, I'm trying to encourage it. I just realized something there. But it's not um, it's not going well, but I almost reached like the section above bug stock. So we're trying to make it back there. I could be a punching bag. No, I, I actually couldn't hurt another person. Like, Unless we were doing a, like, a punch exchange thing where we're punching each other in the arm or something to test each other's strength. Then I'd consider it. Unless we were in a sanctioned boxing match. VTuber starts threatening fans to beat them up. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I, sh I, just, I should stop. I should stop. No, I seriously do need a boxing bag, though. I, like... When I went to the gym with my mate, I was so disappointed they did not have a boxing bag. That was the one thing I'd love to go to that gym for. Just for a boxing bag, just so I can punch the shit out of it, like... Oh yeah, no, that doesn't work, because it goes up there! I'm sorry, I didn't even say hello as well to you, Pi. How are you going? How's it going? Hey, let me be a punching bag. I'll punch back, but like... Go on. Go on, Deb. No, don't you dare fucking say yeah, you let us punch in, you'll like it or some shit. Like, that's masha. What's the masochist like behavior there? We're not about to get into that zone. I think you like your nuts. I'm not a masochist, but I am. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading your guys' text as if it's all one thing, so like it's all blending for me because you have the same color name. Um. God, that's going to be a bit confusing for me to keep up with. But I, I, I can see the in OBS especially, they do like highlight the um, background of it differently, so. I'm not a masochist, but... Actually, wait, just me saying they're about punching each other's arms. I, I'm probably a masochist myself now. I'm saying that wrong, aren't I? I just can't say it right. It's like how um, KSI can't say, like, mural or something like that. You just get some of those English words that just trip you up, like... Oh, thank God, I actually made it back up here. Um, also, what's important for mental health is to laugh a lot. Let out emotions, cry a shit ton. Um, I, I need someone to just fight for fun. No problems there is coming out alive, but like... I mean... A sanctioned street fight is a sanctioned street fight. <laughs> oh shit, I just realized I'm paused. Sorry, hold on. There we go, I should start moving soon. There we go. Can you tell how sad I am? Um, fair. I didn't even notice. Yeah, no, I just noticed there when I was looking over, I was like, oh shit, I paused there. It's literally just because, like, the camera can't pick up my face because it's too dark. And I don't have any software to adjust the camera because I said it was fucking... had a virus in it, so I just didn't trust it. I shouldn't even be trusting the fucking, um... What we call it? The, like, cam I'm using now, but fuck it, whatever. I've already gotten this far using it, I might as well keep using it. Um... No, don't be dicks. sad. Am I sad? <laughs> okay, we got nut and we got dicks in the same, like, stream. Let's go. Slams desk. Nut. <laughs> nut, goddammit! Nut! Gojimi sama. Nut deska. Right, there's that. There's the cringe little box I filled in there for today with the maid alpha. I don't really play in character, do I, when I fucking do these follower goals thing, do I? As a gay fanboy, I do love dicks and nut. I love nut. <laughs> Oh my god. Guys. Oh, please! Please! I'm, so, I'm too busy just having fun that I can't even play this anymore. I'm just like... I'm just laughing too much at shit, like, what we're all doing now. It's like, I keep reaching that point up there and I keep slipping over it because I keep... Like, my... Literally, autopilot is on right now. 
Please get help, bug. It's been 84 years, bro. Uh, I know I added the bro part at the end, but I had to. I just, yeah. The old woman really wants to see me out of here, so. Let's try and make offer, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I'm literally wheezing, man. That's a trait of, uh... Asthmatic. I say asthmatic, but prior asthmatic. I'm not as bad with asthma now, but I heard, like, Jacksepticeye talk about it himself. He was like, oh, look, I'm grand now in my 20s, but he's in his 30s, and he says it's come back for him, so. I can't wait till I'm 30 and the asthma comes back for me, man. <laughs> how, the, how the fuck am I suffering as well watching this? I mean, it is kind of annoying seeing this, like, same screen that I'm doing over and over and over again. And failing when I've reached all the way up to, like, the fucking, like, log cabin section up above. Like, you haven't even seen that yet as well, which is the saddest part, like. Like, I've, I literally only talk about it, but I could be just lying out my ass, honestly. I could just be gaslighting you to think I've actually made progress this whole fucking four hour plus stream, like. Oh, shit, I didn't know went off the edge there. The end of Metal Gear Solid 3 died, watching you trying to get out of Bob. Why are we here? Just to suffer? I, that's the one you're on about, right? <laughs> Sounds like a skill issue. <laughs> I love the Obama stare. The Obama stare is like what fills me with life. Fuck, I, I was looking at the camera, I didn't see it like... That's the franchise, or uh, yeah, the quote you're using is from, I think, Metal Gear Solid 5. Oh, sorry, yeah. I was confusing my uh, memes up. The most, like, Metal Gear memes I know of is just from Revengeance, like. From the standing here, I realize you are just like me, stuck to make history. All the way over to the, um, um, oh, what, what's the Sundance one again? Or even just like the Va. Wait, no, that's the same one. There will be blood shed. The man in the mirror nods his head. The only one that. Um, those spawned the most memes, I think. It honestly did. Like, I'm glad that I had a resurgent and I was one of the people playing it because that was such a good game. I feel like just downloading it right now and playing it, honestly. But, like, it's such a good game. I actually, like, it's so good that I played multiple difficulties of it. That's when you know I really enjoy a game. When I'm playing it on a harder difficulty every time, like. And then, what what's that little gift there? Sour please, Bear TTV, global emotes. Oh, it's a global. That's a global as well? Somebody in a supermarket doing the worm? Oh, because yeah, I'm singing the songs, that's why. <laughs> oh. Hit the yoke. Okay, right. I'm gonna do something that I should never do when streaming. I'm going to ignore chat. Until I get out of Bog, I need to get out of here. Please just let me out. Walt, please just hear me out. Just please. Ah! I will still be eyeing chat though, but I won't be reading it out loud or responding yet. I just. Please, I just want to make it out of here. <laughs> I want to actually progress in the game before, like, going off today. Or at least try and reach near where I, like, left off, like. And I want to make sure I do it right as well. Oh, thank you! Thank you! Watch me fuck this up, though. It's guaranteed. I actually can't believe I've been down here for fucking what feels like an eternity. <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. I forgot that you can drop onto that. I forgot you can drop onto that. That's why I love this section up here. It's actually so good. It's like 
the game gives you multiple chances, but it's up to you not to fuck it up. <laughs> I, oh my god, I just read the title. Crazy? I was crazy once. I can't remember the whole copy pasta properly. No! Please! Please! Are you kidding me? I'm gone. Um, crazy? I was crazy once. They locked me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room full of rats. A rubber room full of rats? I hear. Now I'm actually just doing that on purpose. I swear to God. Fun fact, the population of Ireland has not reached back to 8 million goal it was when it first was back in no, 1892 or something like that and it still will never reach back. No, not even 92, it's 1792. No, it's not 1792, it's like the 1800s at least. In the 1800s or whatever, and it hasn't reached 8 million since then. Ireland's population is only near like maybe 5 mil or maybe even over 5 mil by now. And it's 2023. It's been like a few centuries and we still haven't hit our fucking 8 million population again. We're like probably the only country on the planet that have lost population and haven't recouped their population in a few fucking centuries, which is kind of sad when you think about that. That's how much like unappealing Ireland can be to just stay here like anyway, sorry. Fun fact, India has a bigger population than China now. I actually do know that as well, yeah. Which is just kind of mad. <clears throat> I'm so tempted to just do the XQC thing, but you wouldn't be able to see it, like. The, where you bring up both your legs, you slam your heels into the desk, and you go, DUDE! What the fuck was that? No, I'm not even doing a chat. No, you're talking. Come on, chat, chat. Come on, chat, chat. Come on, chat, chat. Chat, chat. Come on. Chat, chat. For real, for real, chat, chat. No, like, this is not even. Sorry, I shouldn't be fucking. I shouldn't be fucking. <laughs> I love the metal pipe. I shouldn't even be making fun of him. Like, I, I do like his content, honestly. But I just remember that, like, PewDiePie AI video he made. Where, like, he put XQC's voice through a fucking thing. And he just smashed the keyboard. And he's like, ah, yes, I, the most articulate... I, think, I don't think he said that, but basically it was on the lines of, like, the most articulated XQC. Yes, I like this. Um, yeah, start speaking like XQC now. I mean, let me see. It's just like maybe we can have anything. Guys, 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 here's something. No, no, guys, what's up? You, you, you wanna? I think I'm t yeah, speak. Okay, I'm not even doing that on purpose. It's fucking. It's bleeding out now. <laughs> the accent is bleeding out. Start speaking like XQC and you gain progress. Trust me. Chat, chat. Like seriously, no chat. But, like, like, you know, we're gonna wait, wait, wait. We're gonna make the pro We're gonna make the progress. I say that now, but he doesn't really talk a lot like this. Oh yeah, dude, 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 dude. I don't even think he says it like that, does he? Do it, sit, do it, shut, chat, shush, chat, chat. Why do watermelons grow at all? A great philosopher once said, Ich kiffer ein Gang of Cheeto. No, how's he? I think, yeah, he doesn't let you say Cheeto weird as well. I say all this, but I'm, I'm just I'm just having a bit of banter. Twitch. Well, actually, he's not even on Twitch. So, so actually, no. Twitch could still probably. I don't know. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Whoa, dude, 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 stop, dude. Not cool. Actually, that's <laughs> that's the next cosplay idea. <laughs> just cosplay as a VTuber uh, XQC edition. Once the Sherry Arbor one is done, like, that's when, like, the floodgates will open to new ones. Because before, with that follower goal, it was just like, um... Oh, fuck, I w did it too much. Um... <clears throat> with the follower goal, it takes inspiration from the masks one, where I was going to be wearing masks of people, but I realized how janky it looks, so I just didn't really bother to lean into it too hard. But I feel like the VTuber cosplaying thing works a lot better in its steed. I don't know why it took me this long to figure out that like cosplaying as people as a customizable VTuber is a good idea. <laughs> people sad. No, please don't people leave. Don't be people sad.
Look, honestly, the only way I'm making it out of here is if I just, like, I don't know. <clears throat> if I fucking... If I could actually look at the screen for a start when I'm playing the game, that'd be nice. Also, at the same time, if I just stop distracting myself and try to make myself laugh, like, that would also be fucking good. I could show you some more tricks for Bog. Is there really more tricks down here? There can't be, right? To be fair though, I have kind of defaulted and gone back on things, so that's probably why I'm still down here. Hey God, is there one that just shoots me straight upwards? Like no, like, makes no sense at all, shouldn't even work in the game? Um, oh yeah, and it's been 85 years now, sorry. There are more, you even forgot about some I taught you. Oh yeah, wait, can't you jump from here? No, you can't. You have to go this way for this one. Dude, 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 dude. What the fuck? Yeah, my my XQC impressions got a got some work. Okay, I don't know why I don't trust myself unless I'm on the literal teething edge of the thing. Even though that's not the teething edge, but still, we balling. <laughs> does it even hurt? Actually, it wouldn't probably even hurt. If I did it wrong, it would hurt. That wasn't me banging my heel against my uh, desk, by the way, to test it. No! <laughs> there it is! No! That's an old video now that I think about that. Yes, I am narcissistic. I have to start replacing all the sounds with my own sound. Okay, hold on, wait. Um, balls, yes, balls. Second bog screen has two full jumps. Does it? I mean, this one's definitely not one, I know that much. Oh wait. <laughs> it's half nine, it's half nine, I'm not gonna make it back. I'm actually, I'm legitimately not gonna make it back to where I was. I'm actually not gonna make it back to where I was. You know, honestly, on the topic of, like, mental instability, like, I actually looked at a few of my old TikToks, because I was just scrolling through them, like, briefly, just to see what shit I was posting before. Some of them do make me actually look mentally insane, like. But then some of them are just gas, like. Some of them do have venting in it as well. That's everything that has in common now with, like, fucking shorts and streams. Me venting out about random shit. Okay, no, wait, okay, calm. I'm gonna bounce off the wall. Why didn't I just follow through? Right, this is it, this is it. No, le legit, okay, this time, I know I said I'd just look at the chat, but this time I'm going to stop. I'm going to completely stop. I'm going to have to act like you all don't exist for a minute. Or else we're never making it, at least to the fucking, like, fucking mold screen. We have to do this. Okay, that, that works out. Because honestly, like, I kind of just want to just... Even the Jump King himself is just like, bruv, come on. He's just shaking his crown. That'll work. I love the way that accidental test actually helped me out. Right, okay. Now we're jumping over. Now going up that way, because I don't think that works. I feel like that was close enough. It's okay to take my time, but it's okay to just, like... Struggle. Because at least if I'm struggling, I'm trying to do this better for myself! <sighs> and I don't want the world to see me, because I don't think that they'd understand. When everything's meant to be broken, I just want you to know who I am. I just want you to know who I am. I just want you to know who I am. 
Please tell Vito his AI is broken. No, there's a pro- Please tell Vito there's a problem with the AI. Please tell Vito there's a problem with the AI. That'd be so funny if that happened in the middle of a song, like... If you don't get who I'm referencing, it's just Neurosama, the uh, AI VTuber. Just in the middle of a song, she's just jab like singing her heart, and then all of a sudden just... Someone tell Vito the AI is not working. That'd be such a buzzkill, though. Everybody would be just laughing, but annoyed at the same time. Okay. Okay, serious face on that. Again, I'm sorry if anyone's saying anything in chat right now, but I'm legitimately trying to avoid reading chat right now. So I can actually make it out of here in one piece. Even though that is literally impossible, my mind has been fragmented for a while. Why? <laughs> help her, help her, Bog. Uh, it's like, I don't even take the time to actually think about what I'm doing. I just do what I did before, and I just repeat the cycle. That's the problem. I gotta get out of this, like, memory that my, like, hands have right now. Because it's really fucking me over, mentally and, like, physically. And cyberly. And every other kind of Lee. See, the, okay, this is what I like about this, is when I actually do this, right? And then you jump over here. I don't know if I've told anyone this, but I'm actually the top, like, Jump King player in the world. I just, I'm on a different account right now, in a different life save. <laughs> Uh, just like, you know, this character I'm playing as IRL is not really that good, like, he's actually kind of shite at this game, so that's why it's, like, so much of a challenge and I'm struggling so hard, like. Bad. Yeah, yeah, I might actually just do that tomorrow, though, as I was saying earlier. Like, um, fucking stream on kick tomorrow, just until I see what happens with the policy changes for ads and all that. And uh, be the top uh, Jump King streamer on uh, Kick. You! The only time I trust you! Because I wouldn't be lying. If I'm the only one streaming, I would be the top. On Kick, anyway. But then you have the real ones. With great power comes great responsibility. I wonder what Jump King's, like, actual canon event was to bring him to the point where he's wearing these boots and jumping around the place. It's gonna hit the oak. How do I scrape so close to that a lot of the time and I just never hit it, like? I swear it's like a rarity I ever even hit it, like. That's gonna hit. Just make sure to don't hit it from the back. Because we're gonna have a problem. That's gonna hit. Nah, man, I actually can't wait for next year, though. The Spider-Verse film's gonna be good. Well, hopefully it'll be good. <laughs> ah! I actually will have concerned neighbors knocking on my door soon saying, hey, is the person, like, in your house okay? They're kind of screaming. I'm surprised that hasn't even happened yet after all the time I've lived here, like. But I feel like for sure, like, if we do move house, that is actually going to be a thing that happens, like. Either that or a noise complaint. It's probably going to happen, like. <laughs> just... And the conversation, that's literally like what I was just doing there, just bringing up conversation earlier, like, um, what should we call it? Earlier, Pi of Steve said they like cock, and I can agree. I mean, to be fair, though, when you go to KFC, the chicken's not, like, I don't really know, to be honest. Actually, I think the snack box isn't that bad. Like, the cock there isn't that bad. But, like, I feel like 
But actually, McDonald's one's kind of gone down a bit, honestly, in quality. The cock there is not really that good. If you want, like, really nice cock, you'd have to go to, like, um... There's this place in Dublin called, like, Cluck Chicken. That's where a great cock is made. And served, should I say. Sorry, not made. Oh, you didn't mean chicken. Oh, did you mean Glock? Have you got a Glock in your diary? <laughs> Dicks, my boy! Dicks! Oh, like the fucking... What is that? Is That's like a sports shop in America, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Okay, no, seriously, I have to stop looking at chat. I have to stop looking at chat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to stop. I legit have to stop dead. If I don't, if I, look, <laughs> I'ma hurt you, XD. Casual threatening, let's go. No, I know you're only joking anyway, so I'm not taking that personally. I actually have to, like, I literally will, t <laughs> guys, if you don't stop talking to my chat, I will turn the chat off. No, I won't actually, I won't do that. That's going a bit too far, like. Like, honestly, I'll even be happy if we just reach the moss fucking section at this point. Like, this is actually ridiculous. I was up at the literal tip top of Bogem Topia, whatever it's called. Like, how have I not reached back there by now? I just want to guarantee my jump at this point. That's it. That's a jump. That's a jump. Okay, so what people don't actually know about me is that I'm actually really good at jump game. I just... I like to put on a performance to look bad. But if I really want to, I could speedrun this in like four minutes. Excluding Bog. Because I feel like Bog and upon... Oh my fucking god. Stop talking. Stop talking, Joe. Stop talking. I don't trust it. <sighs> FBI, it's not the time. Got a, got a few more jumps. FBI, come on. Go! Finally! We're out! What? I can't wait to drop back down now in literally a few seconds. Like, I can't fucking wait, man. That was- that was more exciting than reaching that fucking new place up above. That was legitimately better than that. How in the name of fucking God does that feel so much better? I'm not even exaggerating as well. Like, I feel so good now after finally completing that part, like... Then all it took was my sanity. Holy shit, like... Oh my god. The proficiency of this guy! The actual proficiency. Holy shit. The mega proficiency of this fellow. His proficiency levels are off the chart, mate. Absolutely staggering. He's even tripping on himself. How in the fuck? How is he doing this? Back down to Wait, did you play that sound because you actually thought I was going to drop down back to Bog? <laughs> silly, silly, silly. I probably will soon, but not, not that soon. Have a bit more faith in me. Are you playing that because you miss Bog? I mean, if you really want to, I could just go off the edge right there. I could go off the edge right there. Revisit Bog. Everybody's favorite destination. Oh, excuse me. The actual proficiency of this man, though, is ridiculous. I can't believe this man. Like, the moment he reaches out of Bog, it's like the weight has been lifted off his shoulders. And, like, what's even better about this section is that Fly doesn't exist. That Fly has said, lol, I'm going. He actually pulled a YouTuber apology video and just left. Like, I can't believe that. 
he actually fucking left. And I say an apology, because he left the letter. He forgot to write the words, I'm sorry at the end. But hey, you know what? I still forgive him. Like, oh yeah, wait, I could just do this. And I can get back up. Like, it's madness. I know I should be reading chat by now, but I really want to get back up to that fucking section, man. And if I can get into that new section, I actually will call it quits there. Because I shouldn't be shouting this much, because everybody's going to go uh, going to bed soon. Okay? <laughs> Okay, just, let me just pause for a minute. Okay. <laughs> Maybe. I'll send you two links in a few seconds. I'm gonna have to check them out before I go. Oh, shit. Wait, how do I... Oh, because you can't... Actually, I can, can't I? Okay, this is gonna be stupid. Well, actually, I'm not gonna do it then. <laughs> if, if it's stupid, then don't just don't do it. Just as simple as that, Joe. Just don't do it if it's stupid. Like, do the proper thing. Be a man. Be a man. Eat a Yorkie bar. Remember when, like... Actually, Yorkie bars are good. I can't lie. Oh, and remember... Oh, Joe, remember when you fig... Oh, fuck. Remember when you... Remember when you figured out up there how... Hey, okay, you got them. It's for Bog. Thanks for the confidence, God. Thanks for the confidence that I will drop down to Bog at one stage. It will, again, I, I it, to be fair though, I am kind of guaranteeing at this point, because we've, we've literally visited Bog every fucking stream. Like, look, we're about to go back down there now. I swear to good God if we fucking fall. Okay, hold on, wait. I, I need to make sure I'm lined up right. Squeezing my fucking thighs together. I just can't handle this. I 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 can handle this though. I can handle this. I can fucking handle this so well. I can handle this. I can handle this. I got 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 this. I'm like that Sans meme where like you play this sound of Sans over and over again, but then you start speeding it up slowly over time. So it just sounds like you're just making a fucking particle accelerator of just Sans' voice. Cha cha cha, like, good. It's so funny how, like. I need to take off the eyebrows, uh. Follower goal. I think the eyebrow follower goal is so lame, honestly. It's like, oh, color my eyebrows blonde. When my blonde hair phase was like last year. <laughs> cool. But to be fair though, the blonde, like, or not even just the blonde eyebrows, just with the bl eyebrows in general. Like, th there's not really much point in changing them, is there? I'll make it a bench follower goal for sure though. So if anyone wants to pull it back out of the vault in the future, they can. Okay, no, but seriously, good. Good, watch this. <clears throat> Figaro, 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 Figaro. Damn, are you just saying my singing shit, like? How dare to die. My leg is bouncing so much, it's fucking distracting me. Honest to God, I can't even stop it, like. <sighs> I don't know why I do that on the table. I just rub my hands in circular motion as if there's a fucking DJ table right below me. Like, and I'm spinning discs like a DJ. Fun fact, DJ means disc jockey. Because you're literally like jockeying discs or something like that. I don't know. It just is disc jockey though. Fun fact, I am going to fall back into the bog at some stage. I actually am mentally, like, not my age. Hi, Ghost. How's it going? And I think I've proven that again and again and again. Okay, see, so you do it like this. What time is that, actually? I'm gonna start keeping down my voice. Ugh. I still can talk, just not as heavy. A 
Okay, so funny story, right? If you just jump like that, jump like... Fuck, I can't remember how to get out of here. Wait, can't I... I can jump... Wait, I can jump like... I can jump like... I can... <sighs> We're falling. The DJ God is falling in love again. Love again, again. And fight, fight like it's the last, last night of your dance, dance, show them your body. Uh, no, I should be looking at chat. Sorry, wait. I'll, 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 I swear I'll answer you all just once I make it up this way. Because it's literally so, it's so close, it's so close, it's so close. Bruh! It's legitimately so close. I can't believe how close this is. Like, if you could smell the next area, I'd be smelling it right now. No cap, for real, for real. Okay, it's up this way. And I need to go here and leave the bird alone. <laughs> Cock. Well, funny story, I fucked the house. Why, you just destroyed it? Yes. No, you no 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 I don't even have any other comment just no. Just 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 no. Okay, up we go. No 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 Okay wait no seriously I need I need to Oh, I need to concentrate. I need. I need to. I just need, I need, I need. <laughs> Wait, do four. I swear, I'll look in a second. I just. I'm so just. I'm so thirsty for this dub. I'm literally so thirsty for this dub. I need it. I fucking need it. We've such limited time left in the day right now. For this dream to last. I just need to get this last victory. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Everybody stay calm. Everybody stay calm. Stay fucking calm. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you over here? You're gonna hit that one day. But until that day comes, you are free to lollygaggle about. SpongeBob! I mean, it's alright. I should be called my fucking literal insert allegation here. Just because other people have forgotten, I haven't. I'll never forget. <laughs> what, what was that? What? Uh, seriously, what was that? Actually, what was that? What was that? What was that? What was this? <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. I keep seeing, like, your comments, but I need to get this. I just... I'm sorry for ignoring you, but I just, I, I need this. I fucking need this. I want to end the stream on a good note. I don't want to go off thinking, man, I could do so much better than this. What are you doing? Okay, I'm just going to go to the other one. Never mind, I lied. Maybe, oh, fuck, I was going to say, maybe I should quit whilst I'm ahead. Okay, just, just let me take five. Let me take five. <laughs> Sent you an image with fall full jumps of bug stock. Link to an image. I 
don't know what you're on about. There's no such thing as suspicious behavior on this stream. It's not weird, it's just a sigh. It's definitely just a sigh. Besides me? Oh, yeah, it's us. Okay, I might actually- oh, okay. Hi, Ghost, how's it going? This is seriously the last time. If I drop majorly this time, I actually have to stop. Because I literally don't have much time left. So now that the pressure's on, hopefully I do better. Because <laughs> everybody knows I perform well under pressure. For sure. Oh my god, up we go. Okay. I'm sorry, I know. I want to read it so badly that I just want to little bit of progress. Okay, see, down here is always better, because then you can get up here. You can do a little bit of this, a little bit of a buoy down. Do a bit of the moist critical. Hey guys, today I got a cock shelf up my arse. Nah, I love Charlie. Charlie's the goat. Charlie's spirit animal actually is a goat. Okay, look, it's not that major. It's not that major of a fall. It's not that major of a fall. It's not that major. It's actually not that major. It's not all, It's not major. It's seriously not major. It's actually not that major. Wait a minute. Man, did I actually look sad there? I think it's just because I was covering my mouth. Yeah, it's literally because I was covering my mouth. Oh shit, Trash Trash Taste did a fucking collab with Cold Ones. I hope they do the opposite way around. They get fucking shit face like. Um Okay, so Twitch. I'm just gonna look these up. I'm just gonna just I'm just I'm just gonna just I just a little birdie just just tweeted in my head and it was like, yo, look at this, 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 look at this. Look at this. Isn't that mad? I honestly thought I accidentally deleted that for a minute. <laughs> I was gonna be like, bro. Look, for security reasons, I have to do this every time. I have to scan. Even though I know it's literally just Discord links, because I recognize the link, but have to check. Oh wow, why is that taking long? Oh wait, no, these are that's bog. Wait. That's bog. This is bug. Sorry, my brain's turning off. Cause we're reaching that time where I'd clock out. Um and the other one's full bug stock. Oh, full bug stock. Okay, they're just bug stock. So, okay, actually no, I'll, I'll I'll check them out. Okay, I can't even guarantee I'll check them out. <laughs> but like, they are there, and you can constantly remind me and bash my skull in until I remember that they're there. Wait, I'm a fucking idiot. I'm actually such a fucking moron. I'm actually so stupid. I'm I I I don't know why. I thought I was still down in bog and I thought I think I was reading bog as fucking bug stock. I thought you said two links were bog and then one is like full bog or bog. I'm sorry, I just I can feel like Just click it. If it'll load any time this entry, that'd be nice.
No, I'm joking. I haven't seen it yet. I'm actually scanning it. I have to just in case. I'm very fucking paranoid with links. Why does it do that? You know, I'm going to trust you. If I have a virus on my computer, I'll blame you. It's, it's li Why is it saying there's something wrong with that? It's literally an image. Okay, hold on. I'm going to leave... I'm going to leave that on the side screen. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me actually show this. Oh, wait, fuck. I need to bring it back up. Hold on. Where is it? There it is. Where am I now? You know, actually, how about I just do it the way- Oh, for fuck's sake. Feels less sus than some image from things like that. Oh! <laughs> Bro, did you have to raid me, like, <laughs> when I was going to, like, go off soon? <laughs> and yes, hey, love, how's it going? Thanks, Finn, Dilly Din, for raiding us. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll, I'll try and at least, like, make some progress up. Oh, for fuck's sake. If I actually fall down to bog now, I'm actually gonna cry. Um. Yeah, I see him, yeah. Be nice, play nice, everybody. This man, it's just the two of us. I didn't know you were wrapping up to. Oh no, it's just... See, now I at least feel like I need to reach back up to some good place in bog stock at the very least. This actually happened another time with um, Jade Duran as well. Except, like, you're not as unlucky as her, where, like, she literally raided me the moment I went off. So, like, I had to, like, literally the moment I, like, went off, it said in my yo she raided me, so I had to go live again for a few seconds just to, like, actually apologize and thank her. Uh, that outfit, yeah. Pink maid dress. You're missing out, lab. God fab. Zero. I think I'm missing someone. Um, Chad as well, like, they've all been getting all this good, like, pink maid dress, oh, goodness, true. But it should be going soon. Oh my god. It should be going soon. I think it's like another two streams or so before I get rid of it. I'm sorry as well, god, I know you gave me the link to fucking images, but now I'm just legit just doing- Well, actually, no, I'll do it here, I'll do it here. Hold on. I'm just gonna... Okay, where am I on this? Can I zoom in? Okay, where is... That's just here. So you jump to there. Oh, if you get to the one above. How do you get to the one above? What the fuck? What the fuck? The water in the fire? The, the water in the fire? You jump on and the slip platform to the right. How do I jump onto that? I'm scared I'm going to overshoot that. Or do that. You know, I see it. It's just like, it's just confusing me a little. Oh, you overshoot it. That's so weird. But actually, whilst I'm here, is there a better one for this? Jump up to here. Oh, from that one, you jump over to the grave one instead. I see that one. Okay. Because it is way easier to get on the tiny platform from the right side, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, and then from here, you just need to get back up to the other side. So that's grand. I can do that. And then here. And then... I'm literally scrolling up as we go through this, because I have it zoomed in a little. So if I jump straight to where I was before, and then, what were you saying? So that, so no, you overshoot the small platform, aim for the platform behind the, this one? But I need to be up on this thing here, right? Because, like, if I can't... Come on, just click and drag, Joe. Click and drag. I 
feel like I can make it up there though. If I do it right, I actually can make that. The slippery platform on the right side, and from there you get onto the small thing you actually want to get onto. Oh, I, I get it, 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 I get it. I'm trying to keep quiet because, um, I'm, yeah. You just realize now, Joe, that you actually can take the advice of others to progress in the game? No way. I did it again. Are you fucking kidding me? Fuck it, I'm going up here. <laughs> okay, no, seriously. Right. I'm going up here. To here. And then you're saying to me you could just go here? That makes so much more sense. Oh, you're too far. That's so good, though, that you could just do this. Okay, there we go. And then, what are you telling me here? So you can just full jump? Oh my god. This advice is life-changing. Oh, but except you still have to reach here, don't you? So that's kind of just... What? No, you can't. That's illegal. God, this is illegal. I can't do this. I'm breaking the law. Oh, you're gonna make me cry with <laughs> how fucking stupid I am. Like, oh fuck. Well, I have to make it over it like this now. <clears throat> You actually have to be fucking trolling me. No, I'm, I, I'm so, I know I'm obsessed, but I have to fucking do this. I won't let the raid go in vain. We have to close tonight's show on a good note with a bang. Bang is what I'm gonna provide, goddammit. Somebody was saying earlier that monster was gonna buy a bang energy drink. I can't remember who that was, but I just remembered it there because I said bang. Bugsock is way more fun with full jumps. It is, honestly. It really is. Because other than that, it's very just trippy. Because, like, this, bro, you literally skip. What are you. I'm gonna cry, man. I'm gonna fucking cry. I hate it. I hate it. Ma'am, can we bring it back to the shop? I fucking hate it. It's too... Okay, no, sir. Last attempt. I, li I can't keep at this all night. I have to stop. I, I know it's unsatisfying, but I have to stop here. I can't keep doing this. This is actually just too much now. I know I said before it was the last one, but this has to be the last one now. It's only because of the raid. I'll, I had to extend it a little bit. Because I don't want this. I don't want to have the same scenario with Jade Room, where it's just like I leave the moment someone raids me. It's like, oh, thanks for the raid. It goes offline. And I know, like, you probably wouldn't mind that, but, like, I'd rather do better. Okay, right. And then jump little encore yeah essentially this is what this is we're all waiting for it just gotta deliver now nah, that's easier said than done though because as you know my by me i'm not really the best with delivery i can bounce a weird way hold on that's it moron you actually make people I make so many like bad jumping players look so good right now that's my actual skill that's legit a skill only the masters can craft stop stop 
Joe, you're throwing. You're actually... Th no, you're, you're literally doing this on purpose. You're literally doing this on purpose. You are doing this on purpose. I fucking knew it. You are doing that. You're troll... You've been trolling me this entire time. And you thought I wouldn't fucking notice, like... I saw how you did that last jump. You're on the cusp of victory. Or at least what you can count as victory. And you're choosing not to do it right. Where are we? We are here. I need to get onto that platform. And I think I kind of knew this one. But it's just getting to this next platform that's a pain in the arse. Yeah, it's a pain in the arse because I overjump it. Okay, no, I did seriously say that if I... Yeah, no, I actually have... I'm sorry. I know it's unsatisfying. At least we got a little... um. What you call... Not end credit cutscene. We got a little cliffhanger on our side here. Tomorrow, we have to reach up there. We have to. I'm sorry. Like, I, I'm literally on my wits end right now. And if I don't leave, I actually will probably scream when someone in the next room to me is trying to sleep. And I feel bad. Since someone raided us, should we raid someone else? I don't know. Does anyone have any suggestions? Any small streamers that are, like, wanting to be raided? Or even any, like, fucking, whatchamacallit. Even anybody else in the Jump King category. Just send a pink maid after them. Oh shit, there I am in the middle. That's so weird. That looks like F1? Why is F1 shit here? Oh, wait. Someone races. Ooh. Should we? I don't know. I think we should. Unassigned C actually looks like a good raid target. I wish, like, the people who, like, raided me before were still on, but, like, they're never on when I'm, like, on myself, so. How about it, boys? Let's raid. Right, how do I do this, though? It's not a race, but unassigned seat is very interesting. Grand. Uh, raid. Right, how do I do this? Like, I've never raid channel and then this. There we go, the raid has been created, let's go. Right everybody, buckle in, we're about to go raid uh, Unassigned C. Thank you for watching the stream, and uh, yeah, hopefully I'll see you tomorrow.